the success of this burial. May God bless you. It's okay, Mama. Thank you As very you much. As you go back, may God guide you back safely. Amen. 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 Mama, it's okay. Stop crying. What happened has happened. Oh? Stop crying. I've already told her that. Not to worry again. My husband was a good man. Mama, it's okay. He deserve to die like this. It's okay. God knows best, okay? It's okay. Take it easy. Mama, put yourself together. I have to walk them. Yeah, it's okay. Oh, Alice, Mama, let's escort them. No, no, it's, it's all right. Can you take it? Let me don't worry. I'll walk you. Sure. Mm -hmm. Alright, save my in-laws. Yeah, alright. Thank you. Mama, Mama take care. Huh? Oh, oh, Mama. Mama. Oh. Yeah. Ah. In-law, save. Alright, thank you. Mama, it's okay now. Stop crying. Stop crying. I think Mama's actions shows she really loved her husband. That's a lie, darling. My mother overdoes things sometimes. I'm telling you the truth. Yes, my sister is right. My ma Mama does that a lot. She was only expressing herself. What? Yeah. You see, your people should take it easy with my in love. She's the only one I have right now. Exactly. I love yeah. her. She's my mother, too. Mm -hmm. So, darling, let's walk you guys to the junction where you'll no, get no, no. a bike. We're waiting for the taxi here. You can get a taxi here. Look no, you at can't. the taxi driving. Yes, book for one already. I one already. I a taxi. Baby, come, let me walk you to the junction. You won't get a taxi. Look at the place. It's, it looks dry. Okay, let's walk. Let me, let me, let me help you. Let me show you my if you say no to a woman's government, you're in trouble. Of course not. You know what? You women are stronger than men. Yes, of course we are. Not physically. around the world. Girls around the world. I really want to thank you for your kindness during Papa's funeral. We appreciate all the support you gave to us. You've really shown you are a good man. May God bless you. My sisters and I and my mother are never going to take this for granted. Thank you. Yeah. Ma, you sounded as if I am an outsider. It's only natural that I should give your father the befitting burial that uh, he deserves. And don't forget that uh, he was my elder brother and uh, he single-handedly sponsored my education. Your mother can attest to that. Udoka, am I lying? Udoka, it's not a lie. My husband saw you through school. With that notwithstanding, I'm just particularly thankful for everything you did towards the burial. And uh, you're not like the other men who start feeling a sense of entitlement as soon as the disease is buried. You're just different. You should know me by now. I believe that um, everyone has the right to do whatever they wish to do at any given moment. Even our culture depicts that by saying that when a man dies and buried, his immediate brother should own everything that he had. But I don't subscribe to that at all. It's not part of me. And I don't want to be part of that. So you lay claim to my children and I? Uh, I wish I can. I have concern to... Uh... My duty now is to be the father. They're no longer having. So that's my primary concern. Stop referring to my children as though they are kids. Look at them. They are full-grown women. They are even married. So they're not children. Well, that is quite understood, but uh, I hope I made myself clear. Mm -hmm. Uncle, don't worry. Everything will be fine. Sure, I know. Everything will be good. Well, what about your husband? They left uh, in the after the burial? Yes, Uncle. Ola's husband and mine traveled. 
Whilst Geraldine's husband had to go back to work. Oh, I must say uh, we are proud of them. They, they did their best. Thank you. Everybody's Uncle. talking about them. Thank you. Right. Mm -hmm. So I'm happy. At least. Uh, Truth. What truth is she saying, Geraldine? What truth? It's her mother we are talking about here. All I am saying is that Mama is no longer a young lady. I mean, even if she's doing all those things, let her do it with people of her class. We all know how her behavior contributed to Papa's death. Yes! Bala, shut right. up! Shut up your mouth! Shut up your mouth! Are you listening to yourself? As a matter of fact, we are in public! The neighbors could probably be listening. Regardless of what Mama has done, regardless of her excesses, she's still our mother. Why would you talk about her like that? But what, so what are you insinuating? What I'm saying now is, 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 this, is this strange to you? I mean, why are you trying to cover her up? Why are you covering Mama? I don't understand. Even though Mama looks younger than her age, but she has to respect herself. Talk to her. I know she listens to you. Biko, tell her that we, her children, we are really ashamed of her. And who says I've not been talking to Mama? Sometimes I, I, am, I am left with no option than to think Mama is probably under a spell or something mm -hmm. because I sincerely cannot tell what is wrong with her. Ma, Mama is not under any spell. Trust me, she's doing that thing with her full chest. You don't know Mama. <sighs> Mama should respect herself, if not for anything, for the sake of her children and her dead husband. You know what? Please. I know she listens to you. Tell her that we, her children, we are ashamed of her. Mm -hmm. If you're not ashamed of your mother, I am ashamed of her. No problem. Girls, let's not forget, if anything happens to mama, all of us will still feel it. She's the only parent we have. She's all we have right now. I have my husband though. <laughs> Me too. I have my husband. Really? Yes. Yes. Trust me, Ma, if this mama's attitude continues, I will not step my feet into this village again. And I'm sticking to it. <laughs> me too. I'm not going to come. Me. I forbid you to. I forbid you to. What has come over you? It... We're talking about our mother for crying out loud. Try and talk to her. Well, I think this meeting is over. Huh? Of course. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> We are, yes, it's not like we are trying to work out on you, but please, of course, just talk, talk to, to mama. mama. Just <laughs> talk <laughs> some sense. On a no go go. You are she the other. listens to you. Talk to her. As you the first the daughter, you are her. not walking away, but talk to your mother. Ah, that. God, I don't even blame my sisters. My mother is the cause of all this. Huh? Why can't she just respect herself for the sake of her late father? What kind of embarrassment is this? Sister Duka, who just buried your husband? I don't think this is right anymore. <laughs> Master Andrew! Andrew, Andrew! <laughs> That's funny. I mean, why are you laughing? Come on. This is no longer right. Our beautiful time together is no longer right. Our jiggy jiggy, our fun time. Stop. It is not right. And you know it. Stop asking silly questions, please. Pastor Andrew, the quick one. When is adultery a good thing to do? When is it a good one? Come on. My husband is dead and buried. 
Ours is no longer adultery. Ours is fun all the way. In fact, it's called love. You know how you feel every time I touch you? <laughs> Sister Udoka, you have three grown up children, three grown up girls. So, imagine they find out what we're doing. Besides, you still need your husband. This is not right before God. I know it. Stop leading me. Is it my fault? Don't look at me. Everything all for you. Is it my fault? So, this is all you have to say. Is it my fault that I'm young and irresistibly beautiful? That you melt like a jellyfish under my torch? That you beg to have more? That you beg to always be with me? Is it my fault? Your fault how? I don't know what you expect to hear from me. Just calm down, let's enjoy this. You don't have anyone to call you bang on your door to ask where his wife is. You just have me all to yourself. Come on. Listen, now let's enjoy this moment. My husband is dead. So ours will no longer be adultery. Ours will be for all the way. Come with me. Come. Come on. I'll see you again. <laughs> Love you. Lord, have mercy. Mama, where have you been? What nonsense question is that? You went out since morning without telling anyone your whereabouts. What rubbish are you talking about? Must you always know my whereabouts? What is wrong with you? Really? Mama, I am tired of you. I and my sisters are tired of this kind of life you are living. It's becoming very irritating. Oh. I should start crying, right? <laughs> As a child, I am. I should start crying. Please get away. Let me enter the room. I'm not stopping you from entering the house. I am not, Mama. It's high time I packed my things and leave this house. I am tired of your troubles, Mama. What did you just say? I said I am tired of your troubles. You're tired of my troubles? Yes. Mama, you are my daughter. That you are married does not give you the impetus, the right or whatsoever to talk to me in the way you are doing right now. But this should be the last time you try it. I'll show you the kind of person I am. This is sweet 16 you're talking about. I should live my life. Lea Wako said, Come. So, what? Pity, Shawalina. Ice cream. In case in a shop, right? Fresh and beautiful. Mama, sweet 16. Mama, so she go to yum, yum, yum. Yes, I do. I cannot even explain how all this started. How? Have I gotten myself into what? Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Honestly, I do not know how all this started. But it has to stop. I am a man of God who is not respected 
to be involved in an act like this. Satan, get behind me. It is written in the Bible that I shall build my church on the solid rock and the gate of hell shall not prevail against it. I forsake everything that is not of God. Lord, I cannot do this alone. Give me the strength to live above sins and temptation. Um, it's barely three weeks since after your father was buried and she's back with this. It's not acceptable at all. Uncle, I sincerely cannot tell why my mother is doing this. Hmm. You just, what did you just call her? Mama, now my mother. <laughs> Sweet sister, that's what the entire village calls her. I heard she even said that to me herself. Now I know why Ola accused her of being responsible for our father's death. Well, your sister wouldn't be completely wrong if she said that to her. Um, I mean, the whole village you know, has condemned her reckless lifestyle. And my sisters are threatening never to step their feet in this village if she continues this no, way. No, 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 they won't do that. I mean, this is your mother we're talking about, no matter what. She's still your mother. Same thing I told them, but I equally understand their feelings. Mama, 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 mama. Well, I, I think, uh, well, I understand their pains though, but one of you need to take out of this village. It will remedy this whole thing. Uncle, huh? well, what are we going to do about it? How can we remedy this situation? Well, uh, I don't know, but um, I think uh, one of you need to take out of this village. Uncle, how are you sure she's not going to continue wherever she goes? Oh no, it won't happen. Even if it is going to happen, it will be for some time. Of course, I know. But by the way, where, where, where was she when I came to your house? <laughs> I can't tell you. Do you know Mama left this house for hours without saying a word to anyone? When she came back, I asked her. She told me, I'm sweet sister. I will live my life the way I want it. I am tired. It's becoming frustrating and embarrassing, Uncle. Come walk, baby. Eh? Six, you and I know that is impossible. That is suicide mission. But this is the only thing we can do to remedy the situation. I don't think so. But I, all I want is to save my marriage first. Every other thing can come in. Well, like what are you insinuating? Isn't it obvious that our husbands, they are not safe with the likes of Mama around them? Come on. Geraldine and Ola, come on. I mean, we're talking about our mother. Huh. She doesn't say so much about her now. It hasn't gotten to that. Hmm? Hmm. So what are you insinuating? That we should take her in? Is that what? Yes. Ha, ha. With everything we've seen ahead. Mm. Yes. Ha. Okay, Ola. Ola. If you say so. Ola, how about you? Ha. It's not okay by me. Yes. We are not living in the same house together. Okay? One person needs to experiment it first. <laughs> Obviously, it can't be me. No. <laughs> Your Diolu, she's the other, so... Ada, 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 Ada will start first. Ada, please go with our mama. Mama, you because you want me, gay. Now, so you go to the Jay, a question woman, no, I mean, it's here. Everything I double while I'd like us to have a word. You can see I'm very busy. Please, let it be some other time. Sorry to interrupt your privacy. I just want you to know that I and my sisters will be going back to the city next week. <laughs> hey, that's good news. It's okay. At least people have tried. I will come and visit you one after the other. At least I appreciate your coming to be with me. No, Mama. You are coming with us. What is that supposed to mean? Mama, life here in the village is hard. At least it's far better in the city. Yes. Am so I complaining? 
Have I ever complained to you that life here in the village is hard for me? Okay, now, if I follow you to the city, what happens to the things I do around here in the village? Who takes care of them? Things you do like what, Mama? I run a lot of things around here. A lot of things like what? You girls should go back to your husband's houses. I will come and visit you at my own time. Now, do my here, my boy. Mama, if you don't go back to the city with us, we will never step our feet in this compound again. So be it. Fine. Let it be like that. Who is complaining? After all, I've raised you girls honorably to find yourselves suitable husbands. And that is the joy of every mother. Good luck to all of you. And you want to rub shame on the faces of the same daughters you raised honorably to find their husbands, right? Is that honorable? I don't know what you're talking about. And excuse me, I would like to be left alone. Want to read my chat? Can you share? What's your husband there? I'm going to just give it a deep thought, please. Pedro, yeah, I am tired of waiting. As a matter of fact, I'm beginning to ask myself, why did this man keep us waiting? I don't understand. If you know that it's not coming, you should just tell us, let's go back. Well, I... I, I think I suspect a foul play. I mean, his numbers are switched off. And I don't know. Let's just keep waiting for him and see what happens, all right? All right. Let's keep waiting. But I think something is wrong. Yeah, because his phone, his phones are switched off. I've tried him a few times and it's not connecting. Let's just keep waiting for him. Um, Pastor, my sisters and I decided that I should come and see you regarding my mother's character. Since she's a member of your church and you are pastor, I think she will listen to you better than us. That is why I came here. Thank you very much, uh, Sister Geraldine. You see, I am very, very elated and I truly appreciate your love and care towards your mother. Thank you. You see, we are all humans and as such subjects to temptation. No wonder the Bible says, for all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. No one is perfect. You see, rather than persecute your mother for perhaps what you think she's doing, I would advise you show her more love, compassion, and care. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Pastor. But that is not the kind of treatment my mother needs. What kind of treatment do you think she needs? Rather than painting black and calling it white, why don't we call it spade a spade? <sighs> Sister Geraldine, it is not always that way. It's even the Bible made us to understand that we should love our enemies and pray for those who persecute us let alone your mom. I mean, if the Bible could encourage us to pray for our enemies and even love those who persecute us, I mean, your mom here, we're talking about your mom here. I'm so sorry to cut you short. Pastor, but please, the reason why I'm here is for you to talk to her. Let her turn a new leaf. She's doing too much. Yeah, she certainly will. Trust me. Thank you so much. Um, 
Another thing is that I and my sisters we've decided that we will take our mother along with us to the city. Oh, you mean you want to take her along with you? Yes. Is there anything wrong with it? Uh, no, 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 nothing. It okay. is well. Let me pray for you. All right, thank you. Father Lord, in the name of Jesus Christ, I want to thank you for the life of your daughter. I did not do anything. My husband came back last night and told me I must leave his house. And this morning, before I knew it, he packed my things and threw them out of the house. Just like that. You did not do anything wrong. But, um, I don't get this, Adese. You mean your husband sent you packing without committing any serious offense? I did not do anything. I did not do anything. This is serious. Papa Adese, this is no time for jam examination. This is no time for unnecessary questions. It is action time. Take your daughter to that fool and warn him not to repeat this next time. Ah uh -uh. Um, others, it's okay. I will look into this. Uh, in fact, let me call him right away. Papa Adese, you will not listen to me. I said that this is not a phone call issue. Eh? Will Take you your daughter back, back to him. Will you stop this woman? I've told you that I'm going to call him on phone first. Stop pushing me around. Ah. I am now pushing you around, right? Bam, 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 bam. You have a neck and a push you around. I feel good. Take our daughter back to the husband. It's not a pushing around. You so bad. Do what you want. May I first arrive? Man, who was up? I don't push you around. Papa. My mama said it's correct. People would start laughing at me when they found out my husband chased me out of the house. <laughs> Papa. <laughs> well, I must say that uh, I really appreciate all of you. Thank you very much. I mean, the burial, the peace, and everything. We're, we're proud of you. Thank you, Uncle. As a matter of fact, we love our parents, dead or alive. So we we'll do everything humanly possible within our powers to make them happy. Oh, Udoka, Chai, you have good children. Well brought up. I know, they all took after me. Can't you see? Mm -hmm. <laughs> we did. <coughs> you all did. Look at you. Look at her hip. Look at this one. This one is carrying double portion of the hips. This one, even her slim and smallish body, yet her shape is gang gang. And her light skin. You have brain, I have brain. So my children are just like me. Oh, well, I would talk. I don't go that far. Huh? It's okay. Well, so, what means are you people going with? Okay, I've already called a driver that will pick us up. We're supposed to take the bus to the city, but we have a lot. We have some food stuff, mm -hmm. we have oil, so many things. So yeah. a driver will pick us up. Oh, it's okay. Oh, all oh, thanks to your mother. I decided. No, uh, we actually bought them from the market. Oh, <laughs> that is nice. Really well, the credit goes to your mother the same. Simple. <laughs> yes. Uh, well, um, I pray that God will guide you safely back to your destination. Thank you, Uncle. Uncle, thank, thank you so much. Ma, this is your husband's new house, eh? Mama, we make it so much sense. Is that what you're supposed to say? As a matter of fact, my husband's house is my house. We are one. So you're supposed to say, Mama, your house is beautiful. Your house is magnificent. Better. Mm -hmm. It is the same thing. If I say your husband's house or your house, it means for both of you. So your house is beautiful. Your house is so fine. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Ki. 
Okay, fine, fine. I have to go, Mama. I have to go. So, <coughs> so soon? Mm -hmm. You just got here. Yes, oh. I know, but I'm tired. I need to go home and rest. You can rest here then. Mm -hmm. House is a house. Mama's house. Ola's house. House is a house. Ah, oh, Mama. Kindly allow her to go. Her husband and mine are coming back tonight. Oh, wow. Your husband is coming back tonight? Mama, why the excitement? Ah, because her son's in law are coming back. No, I wonder. I'll tell her. Mm. Okay. So, and I, I need to go so that my husband will not meet my absence on his arrival. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You have her. You know one go. I mean, I'm going home. Uh, are you not missing your husband? I miss him. My camera here. <laughs> <laughs> no, hey, I'm going yes, I'm the only one who's not missing my husband here. Uh -huh. <clears throat> <clears throat> So now you have succeeded in pulling everybody away. Are you happy now? <laughs> oh, Mama. How did I pull everyone away? And we're all here. <sighs> no, but we're all married. And a lot have changed. Mama, don't expect us to be clingy like that. Baby. Yes. Before you became wives, you were daughters. Not true. Yes. Now we are wives. A lot has changed. Things are no longer the same. Okay? Don't worry, Mama. I'll be coming to see you, okay? Mm -hmm. Thank you, my daughter. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want to hug me? Not really. Because you're always rude to me. You were once my favorite. Before you married that man. Mm. So what changed? I... Because of, well, is it really bad though? Absolutely. Irrelevant. <laughs> so let me walk them to the gate. It's okay. Give my life. Don't be it's not. Let me walk you guys. I love you, Mama. It's not fake. Trust me. If I had allowed you to say what you wanted to say, a lot would have spoken. <laughs> don't mind her. I don't know why she spent that mama in loss. But wait. Hold on. Is there something that you're not telling me? I don't understand. What do you mean? I don't know. But just let me in. I want to know. What are you talking about? I don't know. But whatever it is, I will surely find out. Oh, really? So you're angry right now? No, I'm not angry. I'm not angry at all. Both of you are in the habit of keeping things away from me. Those things are irrelevant to you. Oh, really? Yes. Mm -hmm. They are not relevant. Mm -hmm. But just like the ones I'm keeping to myself, they are not relevant to you too. How? So, why are you talking like that? Wait. You two mean to tell me you've not noticed that Mama and Pastor Andrew, they are having a secret affair. What? How? You must be joking. How? Me joking. I'm not joking. I'm telling you the truth right in the church. They are having affairs. God forbid. This can be possible. Well, this is how I found out. Yes. What are you doing inside the pastor's office? I should ask you something like that. What are you doing here? If anyway, if you're here to see the pastor, he cannot see you today. He is very busy. Mama, what? What will you ever change? What's happening? What's going on? What are you thinking, you pervert? 
What is on your mind? Isn't it obvious? Very stupid. Very, very stupid in your head. Hmm. Idiot. Mama, why will you ever repent from all these things you're doing? I want to know. Just look at the way you're sweating coming out of the pastor's office. Is it this sweat? When you press seriously, kabash, why don't you sweat at home? What, is, what are you doing here? What? No, I mean, what are you doing here? Oh, let me know what I'm thinking. I'm finished. How did I get myself into all of this? How? A man of God like me? That's not good. Don't tell me you're afraid. Are you sure? I heard everything. No, 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 calm down. I've taken care of her, okay? That's my daughter. I know. But you sure she's not going to say things to another person? She's not going to tell anyone. I can handle her, all right? Don't tell me you're afraid. Don't be afraid, I'm here for you, okay? I'm here for you, and I love you. No, come on. Why are you behaving like a baby? I know I won't touch you. I know you're already afraid. You won't be able to do anything now. It's like, okay. Bye. Bye. Don't you to go here again. I'm not going to give you my choice. Lord, have mercy. So we are. She know the grace that she be mama at all now. She know the shiva, her eye the glitter. Anywhere she there, you go see wahala for there. Boy, mama sweet sixteen. Ah, I just so she go the yum yum yum. Ah, boy, mama sweet sixteen. Ah, I just so she go the yum yum yum. Ah. Mama ni because you want me gay. Ah, so you go the pium pium pium. Ah, Jay, na push can woman no a be this ya. Ah, Everything a double wahala. Ah, women no ya watch your husband dey a party ya. So we sixteen and I got the man on board. Mama ni na gan the girlfriend do ya or your boyfriend ya. All I'm tight. So we sixteen and they pass it for road ya. Aye. Oya gong 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 ah ajebo mo wa ni na ganu lo ah eh oya gong 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 ah ajebo mo wa ni na ganu lo ah wa ni na ganu lo ah ah ajebo so she go de pyom 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 don't you dare walk out on me what is wrong with you mama nothing is wrong with me you and I know that you are the one that something is wrong with. Mama, how could you? How? Where are your sisters? All and them, they went out to see their friends. Is that why you came here? Mama, please. I would love to be left alone. Geraldine. Geraldine, you are my last child. Do you think I would want to hide anything from you? Maybe you're getting it all wrong. No, Mama. I am not getting it all wrong. Mama, own it up. You did it. Own it up. Please, I am done having this conversation with you. Biko. So you want to go out there and disgrace your own mother? You know I'm a reasonable person, right? I can't and I won't do that to you. Trust me. I'll just pretend as if nothing happened. Can we at least talk about it? Mama, no! I can't. I'm not interested in whatever you want to say. Biko, Apumaka. Okay, let ah. me at least explain to you. Geraldine. Mama, Geraldine. Geraldine, get home, Mama. What is going on? Can you imagine? What is going on? Mama wants us to stay extra three weeks in this village. Really? Mama, why? I don't want to be alone in this village. Yeah. Well, if you people decide to stay back, I cannot spend extra one day in this house. I'm going. Mm. Mm. Mama, I know you're going to me, so don't worry. You can always come to the city and we can mm? always come back to see you. Mm. That's it. Oh. So, this is what all this is all about. Mm. Oh. Mm. 
you surprised though? Yes. I suspected that something fishy is going on between Mama and Daradi. Yes. Thank God she's no longer in the village. Yeah. These things are definitely going to stop. She's here with us in the city. <laughs> Ma, you talk as if we were in Lagos or Abuja or any of those big cities. I mean, the village is just here. Just at the backyard. So Mama can go anytime she likes. I still maintain my stand. Things are going to be different. Yes. <sighs> she says so. Okay, baby, give me a call. Thank you. Watch your husband, dear. I know they are reason for bringing me here. They think they can cage me. Are you sure Geraldine did not tell them about how she caught me in the pastor's office? No. I'm sure she did not tell them. Pastor Andrew's distance will not be a barrier. I'm happy village is not far from here. Yeah. Oh my god. How are you? I've missed you. I've missed you too. How have you been? Alright. I'm glad to be back. Yeah. I'm glad to have you back home. But you're not acting like you missed me. I, I just kissed you now. No, that's not enough. You know what to do. Okay, what am I supposed to do? Of course you okay. do. <laughs> 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 Baby, I'm so sorry I didn't tell you before allowing her to come. Hope you don't mind. No, 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 come on. Mama is always welcome here. I mean, this is her house. At least she can cook, you know? So what are you trying to say that I can't cook? No, 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 I didn't say that. So what are you saying? What I'm saying is, you know, there's this thing about old, older people cooking. You know, they remind me of this firewood jello fries. The taste is amazing. The are you trying to say my mother is old? No, no, no. I never said anything like that. You even look older than your mother. Your mother is really young. Yeah, I know. I give birth to her. Excuse me. I didn't mean it that way now. Come, I'll just do keep it. Leave me alone. I was joking. No cuddling for you Stop. tonight. Stop. Listen, I didn't say your mo Okay, I, you, listen. No, 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 I did, that was a slip of tongue. You're the most prettiest woman I've ever seen. Leave me alone. Put too much salt in it. But you know I don't like salt. Oh, what can eat your food? You already started eating. Mama? Mm -hmm. ah, I have made this specially for you. Oh, the thank you. I wanted to surprise you with my special food. Thank you, Mama. They're really cooked and we are enjoying my meal. Ah. So, we'll probably eat this later. Mama, 
it's okay. I'll eat your food, alright? You but have said we will eat it yes, together. Yes. I agree with her. Well, I insist. Come on, I'll eat the food. I but insist. No, we are already eating, darling. Mama, you can take it back or probably eat it's it. It's okay. I agree with you. Listen, I, I, Mama, there's this aroma that comes with your food. I miss it. I enjoy eating your food. Let's, let's, let's have it. Can you pass that? Let me get what I'm going for. Yeah. Mama, it's okay. Mama, it's okay. Mama's food is always top. I made it for you. Thank you very you much. You will love it. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Right. Yeah. What are we going to do to this one? Uh, it we can... Is there salt? No. There's no salt in it. No, I mean, okay. this one? Yeah, put some salt. She knows I don't like salt. That's the way she cooks. I cook zero matter. Nice, right? Mama, I love it. It's, so, it's delicious. I made it for you. That is sweet sixteen cooking. Beautiful. Mama, you know there's this, there's this taste. Your food comes with. Oh, beautiful. <laughs> Very tasty. Mm. Mm? I love it. Thank you. You're welcome. Mm. Enjoy it. Oh. I can eat from it. Mama. Mm? Beautiful. Beautiful. Mm. Whoa. <laughs> mm. Babe. I feel good. see it. Listen, your mother is an angel. She cooks so well. Do you know that I haven't had a meal that good in a long, long while? I feel very good. Pedro, look at how excited you are simply because you ate my mother's food. Do you ever feel this way after eating mine? Babe, come on, what do you mean? I don't understand what you mean by that question. I know my food may not taste as good as my mother's. You shouldn't rub it on my face. You just embarrassed me in front of my mother. Babe, why are you becoming petty all of a sudden? Oh, me? Masnachi petty? Yes. Well, do you know how many men out there who don't eat their mother-in-law's food? Or food prepared by their mother-in-laws? And I'm eating mine and you're getting upset. You're supposed to be happy. Pedro, you embarrassed me in front of my mother and this is all you have to say. What am I supposed to do? Kneel and beg you? I'm not going to do that. I am not going to do that. Listen to me, if this is the reason why you have your face like an old witch, then you can sit down and relax. Nonsense. You should be happy that I ate your mother's food and I'm happy about it. Pedro! God, what is wrong with my husband? This is my bedroom. My brother, it was a crazy experience. That was how Chief put me in jail for two weeks. I was in Chicago jail for two freaking weeks, bro. At some point, I thought it was over. So, this is the kind of person Chief Wonders is. He's involved in shady business. All that glitters is in gold, bro. Exactly. Are you telling me that just like this now you came back empty handed? Not even a single dollar? This guy has gone mad. Didn't you hear I said I almost died? Eh, but you're not dead. At least you should have come back with something. Okay, okay now tell me. If you die, not be dull like will bury you. Man, this guy, where did we get this guy from? Listen, what's, what's your problem? At least I came back in one piece. Exactly. How could you have traveled to the white man's land and not come back with a single dollar? Then there's no madness like this. Well, like I said, I came back alive. Yeah. That is the best. Just when I thought that for the very first time I would have a rich friend. Guys, we need to step up. Guys, I'm not tired of this poverty. We are almost 40, yet none of us can boast of even a bicycle. It's a shame. Ken, but we are not hungry. At least we are comfortable. Thank you very much, Charlie. You need to school this guy. 
You need to educate him. You need to teach him. Life isn't like that. Okay? Well, if I were in your shoes, there was no way I would have come back with nothing. I would have made the difference. At least, I was able to build a house and also buy a car before I lost my job. Bye, Josepha. If I was in your shoes, there's no way I would come back with you. I know myself. Listen, boys like you, don't worry, I'll tell you what boys like you do. Ah, I guess you're not there. You have them very well. Oh. Food is ready. Should I should I serve it? Um, I think let's all eat here. Sure? Is that okay? okay? You can you can just bring it here. Thank you. Okay. Excuse me. So, when are we embarking on the trip? Yes. You can say that again. Trust me. You guys are not human beings. See who is talking. No, you guys are not human beings. Wait, wait, wait. Ken. What is it? Ken. How many times did I call you? Charlie, yeah. listen to what I have to say. Okay. Ken, I saw you. I literally saw you with my two naked eyes, staring at my mother-in-law. Do you by any chance think she's still a young girl, a slay queen, <laughs> sweet 16? <laughs> huh? But man, Pedro, that woman is too pretty. Man, no woman has the right to look that beautiful. At her age, she hasn't aged a bit. Ever since I knew her, she has been like this. Let's even say the truth, she's even younger than your wife. Huh? Yeah, she looks better than your wife. Ken, who doesn't know that? Ken, uh, if my wife hears you, if my wife hears what you just said, <laughs> better start digging your grave, oh. But that is the truth. What you tell him? Charlie, mm -hmm. I mistakenly, I jokingly mentioned it to my wife. She almost chased me out of the house. She almost killed me. Come to think of it. Uh, uh, yeah. <laughs> but of the truth, mm. that woman is sweet. Her food tastes just like her. Oh, yeah. Charlie. Uh-huh. Pedro. Ken, did you hear that? Charlie. Well, I'm with you. Hey! Uh, wait, wait. Uh, have you tasted our mother-in-law before? <laughs> hey! <laughs> well, see, bro, bro, bro. See, yeah. uh, since I was born, yes. I swear to God, that woman's food is the best I've ever had. The best in the entire world. You can say that again. Guys, guys, hold on. Listen. Wait until you taste her fisherman soup. Fisherman soup? Yeah. Uh. Her fisherman soup. Mm. You pack out of your house and start living with us. Uh, in, in that, that case, case, whenever she prepares a guy, I'm going to go. I will show no, you. No, 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 I'm not inviting you. Uh, no, you need no, 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 invite no. me. I don't, I don't want to invite you. Your house is my house. No, 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 no. I don't trust you. At least you can uh, invite you me. She's not my mother. mother. Ah, 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 ah. I don't <laughs> trust you. <laughs> at, least, at least I'm different. I really don't understand what's happening. What have I done to Uma? She hardly cooks for me. When her mother does, she becomes upset. And I'm terribly hungry right now! Uma, please, can I get something to eat? I'm hungry. Can I get some food to eat, please? I want to ask you a question. Did you apologize to my mother? Ma, listen, let, let's not... No, I said, did you apologize to my mother? I want a direct answer. Yes or no? Did you apologize to her for slapping you? I, I did it for peace to reign in this house. Oh, come on. Pedro, just listen to yourself. Are you not ashamed of yourself? You did it for peace to reign in this house. God, you are embarrassing me. You should be a man. My mother slapped you in my presence. That's an insult to your personality. And what did you do afterwards? You went and apologized to her. Look at me. I've been thinking, how do I apologize to my husband for taking hot slap from my mother? The same husband went and apologized to my mother. I, I, I did it for your sake. Do not do such for my sake next time. Seek my consent. Ask me questions. Why would you tell me you did it for my sake? I never asked you to apologize to a woman that gave you a dirty slap in the presence of your wife. You know what? You know what? Enough of this madness. I am not taking it again. This is literally choking me. Whenever she comes back from wherever she went to, she's leaving that house. 
and nothing it's will change. It's not that serious now. Mom! But can I at least get some food to eat? Listen, Geraldine, Mama is definitely leaving my house. Sis, just calm down. No, don't tell me to calm down, sis. Don't do that. As a matter of fact, we all agreed to try this experiment with me. Let her stay with me. After a while, she'll move to your house. I've tried it, my darling sister. It's, it's literally choking me. It's not working for me. Mama is driving me insane. She's making me go mad. So I can't do this anymore. Maybe she can come over to yours or Ola's. Um, Ola needs to know about this. I don't care. This is not even my problem. If you want to tell her, fine. But for me, I have taken this decision and this decision stands. Who does that? Mama will wake up in the morning, leave my house without telling me where she's going to and come back whenever it pleases her. Really? Yes! No, 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 that's too bad. Do you know, the last time we went to see Uncle that he was asking us if Mama came to the village. Do you know he was right? Mama actually went to the village. No, who told you? Someone told me he saw Mama at the church premises. So apparently Mama went to see her lover in the village. No, don't tell me she went oh. to see the, the pastor. Of course, yes. I would have loved to bring her to the house, but you know my husband now. He can't even stand her. So, you just have to, you know... Mama is leaving my house, oh. Geraldine, Mama is leaving my house. I'm just respecting you and Ola because you guys are my only siblings. Mama is leaving. Oga apu, kwao. Oga apu. Mama needs to change. She needs to change. She needs to change. Mama sweet sister, ah. I so she go de pyom, 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 ah. Oi, mama sweet sister. That's all she got in your young, young. Mama, because you want me gay. That's all you got in your young, young. Jay, a question woman, no, I mean, it's here. Everything a double wala. Women, no, I watch your husband, dear. So, my sister, and I got your one more born. She's out. Okay. Uh -huh. it's no more. No more. I think it's a system. Um, no, Mm -hmm. You go prepare you something sumptuous, very nice, and I'm fast about it, okay? I'm coming now. <laughs> hey! Oh, wow! Where is this old woman coming? Yes, yes. She's here with me. Mm. No, 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 I'll be closing by five. It's okay. Okay. Sis, I mean, Ola is very, very angry. She said she'll be joining me to your house this evening. Listen, I won't stop you guys from coming to my house because you're my sisters. But my stand is fine now. Mama is leaving my house. We all agreed that I tried this experiment first. My sister, I've tried it and it's not working for me. Probably there are things I'm not doing right. So maybe you or Ola can give it a try. No, sis, don't, don't, don't sound this way. Don't forget, you're still Mama's first daughter. <laughs> Mama, I, don't, I doubt if Mama cares. She has no regard or respect for me. I know. It's okay. I've heard you. Just calm down, okay? Please. It's okay. I have to be on my way. Um, Take care of yourself. One more thing, sis, please. Make sure you cook for your husband. I beg. It's very important. Please. Please. Has he not been eating food before Mama arrived? I know. Make, Make sure you cook for him. him. All right, bye. I'll see you in the evening. All right. This man wants to kill me with every day. A double while women know you watch your husband there. She was 16 and I got the one of boy. I get friend or your boyfriend there. She was 16 and they pass it for all. I 
The question is, why didn't her mother teach her how to cook? Hmm? She wants to clean your food in town. Okay. Every day na double wala Women know ya watch your husband there So we sister na na got your pan up I Girlfriend know ya oh your boyfriend there So we sister na the party for the door I Is there drama Oh ya go go Give me a few seconds oh Okay ma we just to thank you for the food It's very delicious as always you're welcome. Thank you. And meanwhile, I did it for you. Oh, and I thank you for enjoying it. A few minutes, I'm coming. Oh, is your wife back? No, ma'am. I'm coming. Wait for me. Oh. This is incredible. Hold on. With those used plates in the kitchen, it's obvious my mother is already back and had cooked for my husband. <laughs> She's definitely leaving my house today. There's nothing Ola or Geraldine will say that will make me change my mind. I can't take this anymore. This is becoming totally unbearable. What kind of rubbish is that? And Pedro can't even say no to food. It's fine. Let's see what happens. So, so my sister, I, I couldn't have rest of mind after speaking with you by the phone. I said, since I am less busy, let me come over so that we can speak it over before going to Ma's place. You know? My love, you did well. Ma is so angry with Mama. She is. She wants to send Mama out of her house. You know what? I am very, very happy that Ma has started seeing what we've been telling her in the past. Yes, I am happy because we told her. Mama is a very big problem. <clears throat> Mama is a case study. So what are we going to do now? Well, we just have to convince Ma not to send Mama out of her house for now. Huh. So are you saying that Mama should continue staying with them? Is that what you're trying to say? She wants to send Mama out of her house. <laughs> you know what? I am very, very happy that Mama has started seeing what we've been telling her in the past. Yes, I am happy because we told her. Mama is a very big problem. <clears throat> Mama is a case study. So what are we going to do now? Well, we just have to convince Mama not to send Mama out of her house for now. <laughs> so are you saying that Mama should continue staying with them? Is that what you're trying to say? Uh, not really. Mama would definitely go back to the village, obviously. But... But what? I just, I just don't want them to have this enmity because of this issue. You know, I just want her to take it easy. You know how Mama behaves. She has to take it easy with Mama. Geraldine, the only remedy about this is... I mean, or the only thing to do about this is to inform Uncle. 
in this matter. Because I think it's your uncle that can settle this matter once and for all. Oh no. Mama is really biting more than she can chew. No problem, we'll have to involve uncle. No, 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 no. I'm tired of Mama's character already. If you say so, no problem. We we'll have to. Sorry, Mujon. Yeah, hello. Alright, girls, just want to make sure you're on your way. Hi, darling. Oh, please don't dally me. Did you eat Mama's food again? Huh? Yeah, you heard me. What is huh? Are you suddenly deaf? Did you eat Mama's food? No, answer me! Did you cook for me? Didn't you leave me to die of hunger? Oh, yes, I did. I ate her food. Really? Yes. I thought you said you were never going to eat her I food. I was hungry. Is that so? What? You're still here. So you're here? Of course. Are you surprised? You know what, Mama? Go in there, pack all your things. You are leaving this house first thing tomorrow morning. Why tomorrow morning? Why not now? I am leaving immediately. It's better. Because I've had enough of your troubles. It's becoming unbearable. I can't take it anymore. Pack your things and leave. Ma, bet me. You will never regret for sending your own mother out of your house. I will not regret anything. You are becoming impossible. Yes, leave. Enough of this. I am tired. No problem. No problem. And you, what kind of man are you? Are you not ashamed of yourself? What is wrong with you? Huh? No, I'm asking what is up, uh, huh? What is wrong with you? I, I was hungry. Must you eat? Even the Bible says man shall not live by food alone. Must you eat? Pedro, must you eat? <laughs> uh, so how is your wife? She went to her older sister's place. I think she's having a problem with her mother or something like that. Ah. Uh, <laughs> it must be about the issue of food in Pedro's house. How do you mean? Well, the woman once complained to me that Pedro's wife is not happy with her because she cooks for her husband. The woman complained to you. Yes. I mean, my mother-in-law complained to you. Is that a joke? Hmm? <laughs> my brother, it's a very serious matter. But that's by the way. How far now? How far with our business? I've not heard from our man. What in the door now? Uh, I, I don't know. I don't know. Ah, it's delaying it, man. What is she still doing inside? I thought she said she's leaving immediately. What is she still doing there? She should leave at once. Let me have peace in my own husband's house. I got your point now. What are you still waiting for? Why did you ask her to leave? Why would I ask her to leave? Why did you ask her? I'm her asking you, why would I ask her to leave? Don't I deserve peace in my own husband's house? You have to answer my question. I don't have to answer your question. This is my husband's house. No, you have to answer my question. Why did you ask her to leave? Because she cooks for me. I am leaving already. Thank you. So save your breath and your strength. I am leaving. Please leave. May God's name be praised. Leave so I can have peace. As if it is my fault that I'm sweet sister. Who cares? What is any you? Who cares? Who You're not a virtuous woman. Are you proud of yourself? Who has it helped? Uh, hey, mama, hey, 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 listen, hey, listen to me. Listen to me. Sense. Hey, Mama. Mama, you're not going to... No, 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 no. She's leaving. Yeah, she yeah, asked me to leave. No, she no, went there when she told me to leave. Listen, Why are you stopping hey, her from leaving? Hey, Allow Mama to leave my house. Let me have listen peace. To me. Listen to me. Mama, you're not going anywhere. She asked me to leave. No, no she leave. I am leaving. Hey, hey. Listen, I'm the man of this house. And I decide what happens here. And I made my decision. Which is... Mama, you must listen to me. Okay. Huh? You're not leaving this house. Oh. And you, don't say that to her again. Really? Mama, yes, let's I go inside. Hey, 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 hey! She's not going. Hey. You want to me, Pedro? Listen, be careful. Be careful. So you want to hit me because I asked my mother to leave my house? She's my mother-in-law. And what am I? You're my wife. I am still 16. Have you forgotten? 
Mama, let's go inside. Be fast about that. Let's go. Okay, okay. Thank you. Yes. Wait, you, you don't like when she cooks it. Is that a problem? Is that a problem? Jesse, let's go. Mama, let's go. Sergio, you know what? You just said. Mama, let's go inside. Go. Yeah? You are a disgrace to mama. Thank you. Please, Mama, please get me. Mama, please get me. I cannot take this nonsense so I, I can't believe Pedro almost hit me because I asked my own mother to leave my house. Sweet 16 or sweet 20, you are leaving my house. Enough of this rubbish. Pedro, what was the meaning of what you just displayed out there? Ma, how could you be so mean to your own mother? <laughs> Listen, if you know what's good for us, tell her to leave this house, else I will leave. How can you be so wicked to your mother just because she cooks for me? I don't care you? what you're saying. I do not give a hoot. It's either she leaves or I, Ma, will leave. Just because she cooks for me. I don't care. Mama, please What do I do now? How do I make my wife understand? How do I make her understand? How do I get myself off this mess? How do I convince Ma? How do I make her understand? How oh Lord, I'm in trouble. She forced me to come here. Even though I refused, she insisted and brought me to the city. Now she wants to disgrace herself and not me. Sweet 16 like me, Udoka, or my man. Ha ha! I'm can live on one one. Can you do what? Pity, pity, go do what? Is it my fault that I'm sweet 16? I can't hear you. 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 I can't hear no, no, me enjoy. No, what one can I do this life? Women, no, ya watch your husband there. She was 16 and I got the one of them. You mean to tell me you're worried because of mama? It's okay, sis, okay? We're here to settle everything. Settle what exactly? Do you believe for the first time my husband almost hit me simply because I asked my own mother to leave my matrimonial home? Is that normal? What? what? No, is it normal? You mean you asked Mama to leave your house already? Of course, mm -hmm. I asked her to leave my house because I'm tired of her. Oh, yes, because I I blame you for this. Blame me for what? No, tell me, should I allow her to continue cooking for my husband? Mm -hmm. Is that what you're insinuating? That is not what I'm saying. So what are you talking about exactly? What I'm saying is that you shouldn't have allowed your husband go hungry because he has told you that Mama will not cook for him again. Really? Yes. <laughs> Well, I know what. I won't blame you. Because you've never been in my shoes. So you don't know how it hurts. I see. Sis, it's okay. Calm down. Um, Let's go in and have a proper discussion with Mama. Okay? Yes. There's no need. I mean, to what end? Why would I want to have a conversation with Mama? Mama doesn't want to respect herself. Listen, my final resolution is that Mama is leaving my house. She's my mother and not my co-wife. So she needs to leave so I can enjoy my matrimonial home. Mama sweet sister, now so she go de pyom pyom pyom. Oi, Mama sweet sister, now so she go de pyom. Hey, darling. Honey, what took you so long? How are you? Very well. What took you so long? Um, nothing much, but um, is that a small thing settling problem with Mama and my elder sister? Mm-hmm. 
You did not tell me your sister is having a problem with your mother because your mother is cooking for Pedro. Who told you? Ken told me. Ken? And who told Ken? She did. Your mother. <laughs> I don't understand. My mother told Ken. Oh yeah. He said the day he went to visit Pedro. And your mom told him. But the point is, why has my wife refused to tell me this? I mean, why is she hiding this from me? It's not that serious. Okay? Apologies. Alright? It's okay. I'm hungry. Pick something for me to eat. But apologies, okay? Mm? It's okay. Alright. So let me get something for you. What do you want? No, those are fried plantain. Oh. As usual. As usual. Alright. All right, <laughs> All right love. Love you, baby. I'm coming. Love you too. is why we are here. The problem is beyond our control. And we knew you would be the better approach for it as our father. Huh. Well, uh, you, you did well by bringing this matter home. Honestly, I saw it coming but I didn't know it would get to this point. Udoka has to come home. Yes. Uncle, she has to come home more. But well, she's threatening us that if we try forcing her back home, she will kill herself. What? Yes. You mean your mother says that? Yes. Yes, she said that. <laughs> she said that Mama insulted her. For that reason, she's not coming back to this village. Can you imagine? And she's threatening to leave the house for Mama. Yes. Hi. Uncle, we have to do something now. I'm very worried. I don't know why your mother should be troublesome in her own daughter's house. It is not good. But all the same, um, I think the only thing that uh, we will have to do is that one of you must take her to your house. Eh? Yes, that will avert this whole thing. Hey, uncle, <laughs> obviously, my mother is not coming to my house. Everyone knows that because my husband cannot control her character. He can't. Uh, maybe Ola will be in a better position to, you know, bring her back to her own house, but not to my own house. How? I don't understand. No, 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 no Gerard, I just want to, Ola, I want you people to understand this. What we are planning to do at the moment is to separate her from Mama and her husband at the moment. Is that clear? Uncle, that is very difficult. It is difficult. Um, Ola, I, I know quite well that you will handle this matter very well. Yeah? You will take your mother to your house mm -hmm. and talk to your husband about it. Mm -hmm. After we're talking about your mother, mm -hmm. it's your mother we're talking about. Mm -hmm. yeah? It's hard though. Don't say it's it is hard. hard. Because mama is taking, my mama, mama is taking more than required. You are the one that will handle this matter very well. Yeah? Before, I, before I, I will come into it properly. <laughs> yeah? mm -hmm. Let us separate her from mama at the moment. Well, that's the truth. Guys, I'm very confused. I don't know what to do. Pedro, in the first place, I think your wife is wrong. If our mother-in-law cooks very well, so what stops your wife from asking her to teach her how to cook? Yeah, I think uh, Charlie is right. Pedro, you see your mother-in-law? That woman is very nice. Don't let your wife send her packing. You should rather use your authority as the man of the house and settle the problem. Pedro, tell your wife to go and learn how to cook. I mean, it's a shameful act that a grown woman doesn't know how to cook. Exactly. Charlie, that's not a problem. That's not the problem. The present predicament is my wife is threatening to leave the house if I do not send her mother out of that house. Oh. 
and my mother-in-law is threatening to take her own life if she's sent back to the village. Now, do you understand what I mean? What do I do? A difficult one. Tell your wife to cool down. It's her mother we are talking about and not your mother. Will she be happy if she hears that the poor woman has killed herself? I think Ken is right. Hmm. Charlie, it's not that easy. It's not. Of course it's not that easy. Because you have failed to act like a man. What do you mean? Like seriously, how could you say that? You, you can't possibly say that, Ken. Listen, I, I shouldn't take such advice from you because you're not even married. You can't give me married men advice. Wait, 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 wait. Who is talking about being married or not being married here? This is how you reason all the time. Do you think because you're married, it makes you wiser? It's okay, it's okay. Yes, no, no, it no, does. No, don't tell me to come no, back. This guy is always fond of this. No, Charlie, we need to educate this boy. It's a huge okay. responsibility Pedro, to be married. Pedro, it's You okay. think because you're married before Ken, it makes you a real man. Ken, are you talking to me? What will you do if I'm talking to you? Are you talking to me? So you think because you're married before Ken, it makes you the real man? Ken, Ken it's okay. It's a freaking responsibility to be married. And if you're not married, do not give me I married give it to you that. That. Okay. 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 I'm going to bring this What can okay. you do? I'm going to bring this What can you do? Down, calm down. It's okay. You can't do shit. Ken. I can't do shit. You can't Ken. do nothing. I can't do nothing. Okay. Pedro, I double dare you. Really? I double okay. dare you. Get okay. out of here before I punch your father. Yes. Charlie, yes. I will commit okay. murder in your house. Ken, it's okay. Please. Yes. Please. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Pedro, please. Did you hear that? Please. 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 Stop. Did you hear that? Ken. You're a chicken. That's what you are. Pedro, it's okay. He's not even married! It's okay, forget about him, please. He doesn't even know when to be married! It's okay, Pedro. Please sit. Please. He's giving me married man advice. Are you mad? Pedro. Are you crazy? Have you gone nuts? Pedro, sit, please. It's okay. I'll beat you up like a little child right now. Pedro. What nonsense is that? Can we? He's not even married. Can we leave this topic and talk about it? He doesn't even else. know when to get married. Babe, what are you doing? Obviously packing my things. I am leaving this house first thing tomorrow morning. So you're not going to hear me out? Hear you out for what? What do you have? You don't have anything good to say to me. Just calling me. Uncle, please stop calling me. I am not in the mood to talk to anyone. Ma, please listen to me. Please, you do not have anything good to say to me. What do you want to say to me? At least listen to me first. Say what? No, tell me what you want to say to me. Oh, go stop now. Stop calling me. Fine, let me put this phone on silent. Ma. Don't touch me. Do not please, touch just me. Just listen to me. I'm your husband. Please listen to me first. Eh? Excuse me, okay? When you're done, I'll come back. I'll come back. Is that what you two came here to tell me? Mama, we don't want this thing to continue. Just go in there, pack your things. You are going with us. It is not true. Mama. Please go in and pack your stuff. Do as Ola said. You are living with us. My friend, shut up. You two cannot just come here and take me away just like that. Am I a child or do I look like a slave to you people? Mama, sorry for that, but that's not what we are saying here. If I must leave, Mama has to apologize to me because her husband has already apologized to me. In that case, Mama. Mama, what? Apologize for what, Ola? You should apologize to me for making my life a miserable one in my own matrimonial home. Really? Yes, really. Okay. Yeah, uh, Ma, please. Go and talk to her to apologize to me. Because I am not leaving this house. I am here for good. Um, um, wait. Ma, please. Just apologize. I will not. 
I am not leaving and this meeting is done and dusted. Let me go have my beauty sleep. I'm in my son-in-law's house. Sweet sister, on the move. Mama, sweet sister, so she go live yum, yum, yum. Mama, sweet sister, so she go live yum, yum, yum. That is the reason I came to see you. I need an advice from you as my guy. Hmm. Charlie, yeah. You shouldn't have accepted. Why? Imagine why. Don't you see what is happening in Pedro's house? Do you want the same thing to happen in your house? I think it's, um, there's a clear difference here. Because um, in Pedro's case, his wife doesn't know how to cook at all. My wife is the best cook in the whole world. Therefore, my mother-in-law will not even have the time to even go to the kitchen to cook in my house. Is that what you think? Yeah, that's what I think. Well, if it's okay by you, then it's fine. Yeah. All I know is that the woman is a good woman. As you know, Pedro's wife has been the cause of the whole problem. Oh, I think you have a point. You have a point. That's by the way. Ah! Well, I don't know if I call this time for men to gossip. Tell me. Tell me about your sugar mommy. Charlie! What useless sugar mommy are you talking about? Oh, I see. You want to mock me because my girl left me? Ah. Can. Your blood to the heart. You won't explode because of this simple thing when I talk now. I don't blame you. Take am easy now. Very soon I go, you just turn red. Why are you? Best not you ask you simple question. Just simple question. Why is he not responding? His last message is over three minutes. Oh! It's typing already. <laughs> Mama. Mama. What are you, who are you chatting with? I've been calling you and you, you're not responding. <laughs> is it who I'm chatting with? Or I should show you the chat? Which one is that? No. <laughs> Never mind. I... Your food is ready. Yeah. I'm going to bring it here. I should bring it here. Mama, I'm talking to I should bring your food. And I heard. I said, serve it here. Yeah. Oh, I should bring it here. I'm going to read the chat. Okay. One second. Who is this person my mother has been chatting with since morning? Even I had to force her to take her bath. And she's chatting with the person again. Same person. husband boasted you a very wonderful cook. Is this a boasting? Mama, I do not understand. What are you saying? That's the rice. The salt is extremely too much. The maggi is like burning my tongue. <laughs> Mama. What it means that the condiments were wrongly applied. <laughs> Mama, I've been married to my husband for the past two years. I didn't know about that. Good. Mm -hmm. He has never complained about my food. In fact, he has been boasting of me cooking very good to his friends. No problem. Maybe you change because I came. 
That is wickedness. Mama, there is nothing wrong with this food. How my wickedness did you see in here? Eat it. Give me money to go to the nearest food vendor. Fast food. Precisely. Let me buy myself fried rice and chicken. That is what I feel like eating. Man, Bobo, you are I cannot suffer in the village. Ne, you are Ne, 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 rice. Hunger. Never buy. Drop it I cannot do that. At least you should treat me with some decorum. Give me good food. I want to eat spiced rice, very moderately spiced, Mama. and okay. one lap of chicken. I am waiting. Hurry up, bro. Let me come with what I will do. What is wrong with this woman? What exactly is wrong with her? Is this what I'm going to be saying in this house? My husband has never complained about my food. It's funny she hasn't told me where she goes to every morning when she wakes up. There's something wrong somewhere. So darling, your food is on the dining. I'm off to my sister's shop. Why don't you just tell me the truth? The truth about what? Where you go to every morning when you wake up. I just said I am off to my sister's shop. That's where I go to every morning to help her out. Ma, that's what you always say. But that's the truth, and I do not have time for argument. Uh, that's the truth. You're dressed like this. I'm eh? off. You're going to help your sister like this. Look at your hair. Go. I have to go now, Pedro. With all this makeup. I have to go. Okay, go. Listen, if you leave this place, by the time you return, you will not see me. It's fine. Eh? It's okay, I mean. Have a beautiful day. Ma. Yes, honey. How are you? Ginika. Ginika, I'm talking to you. It's Ken. Are you blind? Can't you see that I don't want to talk to you? Come on, Ginika, don't do this to me. You know I love you very much. You love who? Come on, excuse me. Ginika, Ginika, wait. Look. I am very sorry about what happened. And I promise you, I will never do it again in my entire life. Ken, so now you are sorry. But when I asked you the identity of that woman, you did not have anything to do with her. Ken, go back to your sugar mommy. She needs you more than I need you. Go back to her, she's waiting for you. No, 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 no. I need you. I need you in my life. You're the only good thing that can make my life work. Without you, my life is empty. Please. How do you go empty, Adi? Ginika, it's your Ken. Remember, nobody can handle you the way I do. Hey, Bubonara. Ken, I have left you. Go back to your sugar mom. Don't come close to me again. I'm not going back to any sugar mom. I'm coming back to you. It's you I want and you I want. I don't want any other woman in my life. Please. I will follow you anywhere you're going. Ginika, don't do this to me now. Please. Eh? Remember, remember the good times we used to have together. Let's rekindle this relationship and make it work, baby. Who is your baby? Who is your baby? Who is your baby? Ken, it is over between you and I. Go back to your sugar mom. She is waiting for you. Why are you disturbing me? Why are you disturbing me? Okay, now, please. Uh, Anna, she's sweet 16. She's better than I am. So go back to her. Then in her mom, look at you. Just look at you. Just, just. Give me a count. I regret ever knowing you. I regret ever knowing you, Ken. Ginika, there's no life for me to live without you. Ginika, I will follow you anywhere you're going. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, Mama, good afternoon. Have you had lunch? Oh, yes, I have. And you enjoyed it? Sure, it's very delicious. Mm -hmm. That means your wife's food was delicious. Sure. <laughs> uh, Mama, what's funny? No, nothing. It's not your fault. I mean, uh, you won't understand. So it's okay. <laughs> Thank you. And why did you ask? She was laughing because I told her that the lunch was so delicious. And what did you tell her? Or oh, what brought up such discussion? She's a mother. You can ask her. Darling! Uh, darling! My love. I'm good. Did you see my mother? No, I didn't see her. Any problem? Just... I knocked at her door. She didn't respond. Maybe she's sleeping. Honey, sleeping? By this time? Of course. It's possible. Mm. Honey, I don't think she's in the house. Meaning she went out. Maybe. Did she tell you she'll be going out? No, no. No, she did not tell me anything. If she didn't tell you, it simply means she's inside. All right. She should be in her room. Right. Okay. Okay. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, Lord, I have sinned against you. I have come short of your glory. God, I pray you forgive me. Lord, forgive me in the name of Jesus Christ. Lord, I want to thank you for answering my prayers and taking away that evil man away from my way. I want to thank you. I want to thank you. Lord, I pray you never bring her back again into my life in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, I want to live for you. I want to live for you. I want to live for you. Take away every form of distraction in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Lord, before she came, I was serving you. I was doing well for you. Lord, I pray she doesn't come back to this village anymore. In the mighty name of Jesus, I stand upon the mountain and I decree it. Take adoration. Who's that? It's me, Udoka. Lord, have mercy. Hi, honey. <laughs> My Andrew, my Andrew. In Jesus' name, it is not my portion. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I decree, I decree, as I stand upon the Elisha mountain, I nullify every seductive spirit that comes from that woman in the name of Jesus Christ. She shall never get me again. What's that? Oh, come in. Good day, Pastor. Good day. What do you want? I'm sorry for the disturbance. I brought my tights. Oh. Drop it. Thank you, Pastor. Yeah, close your eyes. Let me pray for you. Father, in the name of Jesus Amen. Christ, I decree upon the life of your servant that he shall never lack. Amen. To have remembered to pay his tithes, Lord, I pray you open the doors of heaven to shove upon him in the name of Jesus Christ. Mm. For him to have remembered to pay your title Lord, continue to remember him and his family in the mighty name of Jesus. Mm. I decree 
that you shall never lack. Amen. Amen. Ken, this one you're forcing me out of your house. Are you expecting someone? Come on, I told you I have somewhere to go and time is no longer on my side. Ah, yes. You know what? what? Tomorrow is Sunday. I'm not going anywhere. So I'll come back here and I'll beat you up. You think you can play chess better than me, <laughs> huh? See who is talking. That's if your wife will let you come out tomorrow. Ah, uh, okay. Wait until tomorrow. This food is really nice. Can I go more soup, please? All right. Mm. Mm. This food is very sweet. I'm sure she bought it. Where did she buy it from? This will be enough for you. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. What did you buy it? I don't know. Enjoy your meal. I'm just trying to compliment the cook. The person who made it. I know she bought it. It's very old yours. But the truth is, for how long will she keep buying from the local food vendors? Mama put. she leave the house without telling anyone where she's going? That's the problem. That's the problem. I am worried. I am so worried, honey. Let it not be that something else has happened to her. Maybe she travels to the village. To do what? Have you called any of your siblings? Hmm? Have you got any of your sisters? No. Put the call across to them. Maybe she might be there. Right? Yeah. Okay. Let me call on my then. I pray she will be there with them. We hope so. And I'm worried.
So these days I have noticed you've been quite busy with that particular book. Do you mind telling me what the book is about? It's personal. It's personal. Yes. So, uh, it's so personal that you can't share with your husband. I never said so. In other words, I should mind my business. I didn't say that. Okay. So the coconut rice we had tonight. Did you also buy the way you bought lunch? I don't know. You don't know? Why are you always careless each time I ask you a question? It irritates me when you think I buy them. Oh. It irritates you each time I say you buy food from the local food vendor. Okay. I'm sorry. I won't ask again. Hi, Ola. Are you serious? What? Did you call Geraldine to know if she's in her house? No, she's not here. Okay, did you call Uncle? Maybe she has gone to the village or something. All right, all right. I'll also call him. Call him. I'll, I'll, I'll try. <sighs> Is everything okay? No. All I called to inform me that my mother left the house this morning and she's not back. She has called Geraldine, but Geraldine said she's not in the house. There's a problem. It is a problem. I hope she gets better. the moment you saw me enter. Why are you hiding anything? Mama, you are yet to tell me where you went to yesterday and what kept you till late night. No, for real, are you okay? <laughs> You're querying me because I'm in your house? Mama, I'm not querying you, but this is my house. I deserve to know your whereabouts. I mean, how can you just go out like that without telling someone? Madam, it's remaining for you to add cash to it. Eh? So you now control me. You want to know where I go and how I go it. I'm an adult. I am free to go to anywhere, even if to the end of the world. I've been free. Ah, I've got in my legs. Am I? Stop that rubbish show. Stop it. Mama, that is not what I'm saying. Uh, see, if anything should happen to you, I am going to be held responsible. Nothing will happen to Doka. Swiss 16. Look at me. Do I look at somebody that something will happen? Or the mama be nature? I know everywhere and everything I am doing. Nobody will hold you responsible for anything because nothing will happen to me. Wait, wait. Did you call your uncle last night? Of course I did. Mama, mama I was worried. I was worried that I, I, I needed to call them to know whether you are in the village or not. This will be the last time. The very last time you call that stupid man to talk about me. Stop, boy. You are not meat. You have got a podcast. Anything you hear, yeah, village. Let him come and slap me and beat me now. Let me just go and shower now. No, you're my phone. Nonsense. Mama sweet sister Now so she go to yum 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 What has come over her? 
Is this what I'm going to face in this house? Mama, you because you want me gay. Can't you? That's all you got to be. Yum, yum, yum. say something but I don't want you to get angry. If you know it's gonna make me angry then don't say it. Alright then, sorry. Don't say it. Look, I just wanted to know where you get this food from. It doesn't matter. So enjoy your meal. from your mother because they actually taste like hers. Is that how you really think of me? Well, if you must know, I've been the one making all the meals you've been eating recently and enjoying, including this one. Are you sure? Of course, I'm certain. Mm -hmm. I started taking kitchen classes since my mother left. She's cursing you. Let her curse me. That's an empty threat. Okay? Nothing will happen to me because I did not do her anything. Can you just do this for my sake? Just open the door for her. I will not. I'm sorry about it. 
Nonsense. I have to go to my room then. I can just sit here and hear her keep knocking at the door. Better. I'll, 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 well, I'll come out. Not for one thing. I'll come out there and pour you hot water. Who's that? Who's that? Babe, who's that? I don't know, and I won't open the gate till I'm certain who is knocking. My little daughter, your mother. Babe, that's your mother. Maybe Ola has thrown her out again. She has probably locked her outside again. Ma, open the gate! I will not open the door for her. She thinks she's smarter than all of us. Babe, are you... Ma! Babe, listen. Don't you think we should... Mama never returned to the village. <laughs> Wait, you mean to tell me Mama is not in the, in the village as we speak? Yes. She's not in the village. <laughs> Where could she have gone to? Oh, Nobody I knows. <laughs> I don't know. And I don't care. And I don't want to know. But I am happy that I've gotten rid of her from my house. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Mama. As much as you've gotten rid of her from your house, she's supposed to be in the village. But she's not there. How is it my business? It's not my business. No, don't say that. Regardless of Mama's nasty attitude, she's still our mother. Okay? If anything should happen to Mama today, it will affect you. It will affect all of us. Mm. So it is our business. It won't affect me. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. I don't even know why she switched off her phone. <laughs> You're talking as if you don't know that woman. She's somewhere cooling off her head. And she purposely switched off her phone. No. Hola. Don't sound like that. See, regardless of Mama's nasty behavior, she's still our mother. Mm -hmm. Okay? We should care for her. Mm. I don't blame you. Yes. You are saying this because you've not experienced what we passed through in the hands of our mother. You've not been saying this. I don't understand. What's the meaning of that? Meaning of what? No, 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 no. What is the meaning of this? Girl, stop, please. Stop. <laughs> So no, 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 you see, you don't tell her. No, 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 she don't tell me it's okay. Talk to her. Why are you telling me it's okay? Please, I'm going to somebody. What's that? I reckon I'm somebody, right? Yes, yes. Sis, talk some senses into her. Look at you. She should be the one talking to you. She should talk sense into you because you're I, 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 you losing it. It's obvious. I don't blame you. You just open your mouth like God and say anything you want to say, right? Oh, really? God. Well, I have the right to express myself and I will. Oh, really? Are you not standing here? No! What's that? I'm out of here. Please. Oh, really? Geraldine. Geraldine, come back here. Ah! Because I'm keeping quiet. You are keeping quiet for my food. Well, it's okay. It's okay. What's all this? I don't know, but we are just talking. It's fine. temptation is this. I think the best thing is to run away from this house before I die here. Hey! If we move... Hey! I have fetched the ant infested firewood and now lizards have come visiting. I didn't bargain for this at all.
We are here to see Uncle. Uh -huh. Which uncle? Our uncle. Your husband. Please, you people should get out of here. And I say, uncle. Go ahead, uncle. Auntie, well, if there's anything we've done wrong to you, please forgive us. We need to have a word with your husband. It's very important. Please. Rico. I said both of you should leave my husband. Please. Nah, get out. Oh, nah, nah. That's what we say about you. Uncle. Ma, I'm Geraldine. Uncle, good afternoon. How are you? I'm fine. Please, what are you standing outside for? Come in, come in. Come in there. Eh? They are not entering this house. I told you to go out. Eh? Both of you should get out of my house. Auntie, please, if we've done anything wrong to you, kindly forgive us. We are sorry. Just allow us to have a word with your husband. It's mm. really very important. Yes. Eh? Please. You people should leave me alone. Leave my family alone. And leave my husband alone. Allow him to stay here with us and settle our problems. Every time you will be calling him here and there. My dear, so will you stop this? Will you stop it? What's your what's the problem? No, 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 no. Yes, 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 let them come inside. Since it's their house, I'll come back. Better come back for me. Please, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay. What, what's the problem in this house? I don't know the problem of this woman. It's fine. Honestly, I don't know. Mm. Uh, but, uh, we actually came to see you. Mm. 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 Don't ever come back here. Mm. That's my mother. That's why they're here. Uncle, honestly, I don't know what we did to your wife. I don't know why she's angry with us. As a matter of fact, we've never been this humiliated. Your, your wife treated us like a plague. Even when you tried stopping her, she refused to listen to you. Geraldine, I think she's doing all of that because of her mother. Um, um, my children, this I, I am here to plead on my wife's behalf. I... I know she 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 didn't uh, you know try at all in her attitudes, but I am pleading on her behalf. For, forgive her, please. Um, thank you, Uncle. We don't have option. You've always been a father since we lost uh, Papa. Yes, we don't know our mother's whereabouts. That's why we are here. I am worried too. But have you reported this to to the police? Not yet. We decided mm -hmm. to see you first. Even her phone is switched off. What? Yes. We need to make entry immediately. Yes, that's what we need to do. Hey, do a gun name. Please, let's go to the police station. So you mean those people came there and you did not disgrace them? It's a disgrace. <laughs> Have you forgotten who your mother is? I doubt with them. I chased them out of my house. Did you make well great? <laughs> Good. Mama, those girls were lucky I did not meet them here. No. You don't have to worry yourself about that. I gave it to them. Next time, if they try to come here, I pray for you, Okwa, that leg they used to come to our house, I must make sure I cut it off. Uh -uh. Mama, uh -huh. they will not even try it. Uh -huh. They will not try it. See, the Ma next Mama time Mama. I meet them here, I will bring heaven down that day. I will not even look at Papa. I will not listen to him. Your father, that one. Uh -huh. You don't know what he did. He asked them to enter our house, but I chased them out. I gave it to him straight. Yeah. He, he now followed them. <laughs> Good. <laughs> hey. Ah, my father is not a man at all. Huh? He's a woman rapper. Uh -huh. hmm? Do you know what Obina said to me when I called him this afternoon? Obina, your husband. What did he say? What happened? Obina said that I should not call him again. He want me never to call him. He said I am useless like my mother. Obina called me useless. He called you useless. Obina said that. Obina called me useless. That I am useless. Hey! Obina Kuwano. Oh, Kuwano. I can't run around you, Anyway, I 
I don't blame him. I blame your father. Your father is the cause of all this. Had it been he did what I asked him to do, if I am a man, Obina would not have had the guts, the impetus to talk to you like that or even call me useless. Mr. Badera, I am a chair. Hey, Ebuka. Nagabu, I'm going again. Oku wa go ano. Nso bo adero. Mo bi nna. Mama I am troubled. I regret the marriage to Obina. No trouble yourself. No trouble yourself. Everything is different. Everything is different. We talked about going to the village. You never showed up, and you never called to ask how it went. <laughs> I am sorry that I didn't go to the village with you people, but I wasn't interested. I just want to stay on my own and mind my business. Anything that concerns Mama, I don't want to put my mind there. Hola. 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 She's still a mother regardless. Mm -hmm. Mama, that was then. That was then. That woman dealt with me. As a matter of fact, I just want to be on my own. Yes. I don't like what you're saying, so you're saying she's no longer your mother. That is it. I say, listen, I don't mean any harm. But if it's what you think, so be it. So you're trying to tell me that if anything should happen to Mama, you will not feel it. You're not even sure. Huh? Eh? Ma, I will not show up. Oh. I will not show up. Hola, hola. She's still our mother. Bro, how for now? Very well, and you? How have you been? Very well. I'm good. Mm. Have you heard anything about uh, our mother-in-law? No, my wife is no longer interested in that matter. Are you serious? Uh-huh. My wife has been worried. I'm very worried myself. Honestly, I don't know where that woman is. It's crazy. What do we do? I am confused. I don't even know. Where are you headed? I I want to see Ken for a couple of days now. I've not seen oh, him. Oh, Ken, Ken. Yeah, yeah. I actually want to see him myself. Oh. You know, I was passing. I passed his house. Uh -huh. But I'm not sure if he's home. So, uh, Did we... you try? No, I didn't. Because oh. I'm not sure if he's home. So, okay. why don't you just go together? Okay, fine. Where were you heading to before? I was going back home. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So, let's go and check for All him. Right. Okay, All right. that's fine. I, I wanted to, you know, stop by. I wanted to let you I didn't know I'm not sure you're going to be around, so that's why I went to the house. Let's find out. Mama, what? Mama, what? What is it? Did people just met off your houses? What is it? Mama, what are you doing in my friend's house where you're supposed to be at the village? Hey! Is that your wish for me? So you have hated me all this while. I rejected by fire and I returned it back to you, back to sender, a million times. Ken. Ken, what is my mother-in-law doing in your house? Why are you asking him? Didn't you and your wife set me out of your house? Others cannot reject me when you and your wife rejected me. How can I do? Can't you leave me alone? Okay. I'm asking you for the second time. What is my mother-in-law doing in your house? Okay. Tell me now. And Sally, I want to know. Okay. What? Bro, are you thinking what I'm telling you? I think it's exactly the point. Please ask these people to leave your house. Tell them to go and marry their wives. Okay. I'm going to marry your wives. Okay. I hope it's not what I'm thinking. Oh dear. Bro. Okay. Charlie, let's go. Mm -mm, come and stay. Come and stay. Can you? What the hell? Tell him to go. Tell him to go. Tell him 
What have you done? Why did you come out? Oh, shut up. Shut up. Don't blame me. What is it? How was I supposed to know they were here? Huh? Okay, now tell me. How do I explain this to your children? Baby. Baby! How do you explain it to my children? What are you going to explain to them? Be a man for once. Now that you want to know how you're going to explain to them. When you see them and they ask you about it, tell them that they chased me out of the house and you saw me walking on the street helpless. You took me in to help them and wipe away the shame from their faces. Since you're a baby, you don't know what I, to do. I, 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 I don't like this. I don't like this. You've ruined my friendship with them now. I don't like it. Do you, do you know how you were doing it? Doing it hard, hard. What is friendship? Nonsense. What did they allow this fool to see me? I should have dodged the moment I saw them. Hey, they would see me here. What if you want me to make it happen? I can't walk here alone. So she go de pium pium pium. Oi, mama sweet sister. Bye 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 bye. Who is here? Now so she go de pium. Who is here? Who is here? Who is here? Oh yeah, na papa. Uh uh. Ah. Hmm. Okay, my papa. Uh. Ah, welcome. Uh, name is Yagi. Um, tell him I'm here. Tell who? Okay. Oh, he's out. Ah, uh -uh. he's out. Is this not his car? Eh? Is this not his car? <laughs> it is his car. Mwa mwa no no lo told you that my husband is out, and you are asking me whether this is not his car. Is it a must? He 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 must go out with his car. Eh? Oh, you want a motor? Oh, he went out without his car. Mm. He went out without his car. Anyway, tell him I was here. Mm. He was here. Oh. Hey. What else will make him come here if not for Udoka and the children's kids? Mama, Every time they will be disturbing us. Mama, this. Who was that? Who was who? I heard voices as if you were talking with someone. Oh, I was only soliloquizing. You were soliloquizing? <laughs> Hello! <laughs> My daughter. So, how are you today? Huh? Are you serious? Oh, no, 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 I'm coming right away. Yes, I'm, I'm right away. Wait, wait, wait. I'm Nine. Who was that? Mama sweet eh? Who was that? So she could live yum yum yum. Mama sweet sister. So she could live yum yum yum. Mama ni biko suwani ke. Mama so you could live yum yum yum. Jai, I wish can woman no abinisia. Just imagine this man. Eh? Who called him? And why is he not responding to my question? Uh -uh. <laughs> Where are you? Where are you rushing to? To your house. My house. Uh, I went to Ebuka's house. His wife told me that uh, he's not around, but his, his car was parked. 
So I said, let me see you at once. Uh, yes. <laughs> well, I hope all is well. All is well. Have you heard? Heard what? Ha. Ah. Sweet 16 Udoka uh. is back. Huh? Uh -huh. Sweet 16 is back. I'm telling you. Is she huh? Who told you? I saw her with my two eyes. Hmm? Udoka is back in this village. Ha! <laughs> huh? Okay. Ah. <laughs> I was in your house and your wife told me that you are not around. My wife said that. Mm -hmm. ah, but I'm just driving straight from my house. Ah, it's okay. Ah, why would your wife lie to me? I don't. I don't know. I don't know why she would do that. But as you can see, I am driving straight to my late brother's house because um, the the first daughter of Udoka phoned me that the mother is back. Mm, I, I saw her. I saw her with my two eyes. So it is true. Yes. And but um. Where has it been all this while? I don't know until I go there, I'll find out. <laughs> when I get there, I'll find out. Um, um, Ichibuka, hmm? we will come to your house in the evening. It's all right. Yeah. So let me just drive okay, straight to no the place. No I will tell you whatever <laughs> I see. Um, um, yeah, Ichibuka. Wait, you. Udoka children say that Udoka is back in this village. That's what they said. This is when I get there, I will know the truth. Yeah. <laughs> let me drive straight. Yeah. Okay. Um, why is Udoka so troublesome like this? My brother, no talk. Let's be going. Let's go. So she go And I have not seen your mother. Where, where is she? I don't know. Mama! I've told her you're here. I don't know what is keeping her. Mama! Mama, no. Mama, give me. What is that? What are you doing here? Haven't I warned you to stay away from us? Huh? Mama, what kind of embarrassment is this? Embarrassment? Embarrassment, you call it. You see this man? He has come here to play his tricks. I know his antics. He has come here to gossip me. I'm going for Zibira. Okay, you're your gossip to wear wings and fly around this. What, why are you doing this? Oh, shut that? up. I'm going to make sure I know. Okay, now what? Doing what? What am I doing? You just keep deceiving yourself. For them to feel that you like them. You don't like them. You only came to find out where I have been for the past five days. I'm not in my house. So go and tell them that I'm in my house. I'm in my house. Mama, 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 what is this? Why are you insulting him? Oh, shut up. Shut up. Am I in your house now? I'm in my own house. You teamed up with your siblings to push me out of the, your houses. So what? I am back in my house to live the way I want to live. Do the things that I want to do that makes me happy. Then do them honorably. It's not your business how I do it. It's not your business how I freaking do it. You. You're just deceiving them. In the Uruk Buren and your court. Look at your red cap. Go and live your holy life with your wife in your house. Why are you poknosing into other people's houses? What, what, what do you want from me, Ebuka? Okay, because I have... Anyway, I won't say anything because you're a Jew man. I won't have anything to do with you. Idiot. When you finish destroying your own mat, you sleep on the ground. Easy. Rubbish. I keep singing this song. You can never make it. 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 You it. Useless man! Where is that stupid idiot? Ebuka! 
Okay, don't get an aboja. Get eh? away! Why are you shouting my husband's name? Ebuka, Ebuka, Ebuka. Where are you me. looking for him? Look at this one. You don't have sense. Am I your mate? Yeah? Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Evil man. Leave me alone. What is this? Leave me, let me live my life. Now come to what people come put on the more. Leave me alone. What is it? Why do you report me to the moon? Doka, get out of my house. Get out! Emoroya, Osiki, get out. Tell your husband to go and withdraw whatever charge he laid against me at the moon. Leave me alone. Let me live my life. Leave me alone. Mind your space, oh, 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 Mind your space and leave me alone. Let me live my life. Am I living it for you? <laughs> Hold it there. How dare you talk to my husband like no, that? Eh? Is this your so husband? So you think that I would just stay here and watch you insult him? And what will you do? Is it not to shout and write like the mad woman you are? Is it not here? Tell your wife to stay away from me and you stay away from me. Because yeah, get Allah. out of here. I will go. Get out. I will go. But now I'm again and I'm not here. Nobody and leave me alone. Face her. Go finish her. Go say finish her. Leave me alone. Leave me alone, let me live my life. In, 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 in. Leave me alone. Stupid people, you shameless. Up. You are all shameless. You want all look? If you had work, you'll be talking about the woman. <laughs> in, I know you also. You're going to be shameless idiots and I come out of shameless. You are a shame. You are an atom of shame. I know of you. You will meet your doom one day. Ebuka, if you go here, have you seen it? This is the woman you have been having sleepless night because of her case. You have been protecting her. But look at what she did. If you go here, thank God I am here to witness this. If not, Imam Gwamia, Ebuka, come on, or come Manama. Keep on protecting her. If it is in your family, if you pass along, Manorun and Kudoka, Iburi and Nishi, Iburu Nisha, come Manama. Useless man. Eh? Kudoka, Kudoka, don't worry. I will pay you back with your own coin. I know of ya. Okay, so bad. I know. Hey, she is old, but so young. She know the grace that she be mama at all now. She know the shiva. Her eye the green. What is it? Please give me your chance. What is it? Leave me alone, Ken. Leave me alone. I beg now, I beg. Just hear me out. Ken, I don't want to hear any word from you. Stop disturbing me. Go back to your woman. No, no, I don't know who you are. She's no longer in my life, oh. I have ended everything I have with her. And I want to make amends with you. Please, don't forsake me. You know I need you in my life now more than ever. Pico, you should be ashamed of yourself. He goat, you should be ashamed of yourself. Stop following me, I don't know who you are. Don't disturb me again, Ken. Don't disturb me again. Kinika, 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 it's me, your friend. What is wrong with you? What is wrong with you? What is wrong with you? I know, fam. Yeah, come in. Absence, you didn't miss me. I didn't miss you, Sister Udoka. Why? Get behind me, Satan. I am a renewed man in God. All things have passed away. I am a man of God. And never again will I defy myself with you, Sister Udoka. <laughs> Change your ways. 
give your life to God and he will show you mercy. Repent. Pastor Andrew. Well, tell me you're kidding. You're not a, ma a true man of God. <laughs> so you know, do jiggy jiggy again with me. Come on. Leave my office. I mean, use the door. Can you please stop this joke? I am not joking. Leave my office. Come on. What has come over you? I came to see you. Can you stop? Listen. I am a changed man and I will never again go back to my old ways. You cannot lead me anymore. I have embraced God fully and I am fully charged spiritually. Please, if you do not have anything serious to talk about, use the door. I'm really sorry. If I have offended you in any way, excuse me. Like this, I thank you. Mr. So. we have done enough. It is time we embrace Christ. I have done that. Sister Udoka, give up your evil ways. Our God is a just God. Our God will forgive you. Please. I am no longer interested in whatever we've been doing. I am a changed man and I want you to do the same thing. God has arrested me. I am filled with the Holy Spirit. Do the same. Repent and God will show you mercy. Sandra, you cannot reject me like that. I really want that. I've been hoping to be with. Everything we shared. That was in the past. Just oh, please, I beg you. Pastor Andrew, what am I going to do? Pastor Andrew, after everything we did, after every enjoyment, after every fun, where will we be to come from this office? Wait a minute. Welcome. What changed? I am still here. I am still the sweet 16 that I'm known with. My Look at everything is still intact. The good shape, everything. Oh! I am still the irresistible sweet 16. The evergreen. The ice cream shower. Shawama, the short. So bring your shoulder down. Try to live this life and value everybody. Who knows tomorrow? On your man, you see a person at you. Let's see any female look like you. Look at my wife. Don't even have to be so good. Udoka. My wife, my lovely Udoka. 
<laughs> and I held uh, your bag and I said, let me come and uh, meet you. <laughs> you held that I'm back? Yes. You said, let you come and greet me. Uh -huh. Ebulu Mago. Like Ebulu. Who told you? You are late husband's brother. My late husband's brother? Yes. When you are baby. So you now came to confirm so that your saligi, your gossip will grow wings and fly around this village so that you gossip me and spread me well. Okay? Uruka, why are you saying this? Huh? Why are you talking like this? Nobody is gossiping you. Mm. You are our lovely wife. Oh. Mom, now that you have confirmed that I'm back, can you now leave? Uruka, are you chasing me out of my brother's house? Get away! Leave! Leave! Huh? What are you doing here? I should leave. Okay, I'll run. If I see you in this my house again, I will kill you. Okay. I will chop off this your two legs. You don't need to push you. No, 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 no. I, I, I will leave. Since you insisted that I will... I, I, let me let me go in. Get away! Let me go in. Get away! Hey! Madam Udoka, you chased me out of my brother's house. Get away! Look at Moby. Go! He chased him out of my brother's house. Who's so Which has it? Don't allow me to mourn my loss in peace. So what am I going to do now? Will I just be alone like this? Man, like a what? Man, like a what? I wonder what is keeping you. Hmm? 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 Uh, um, I, I said I want us to talk as uh, one good family. One good family. That's why I called all of you to come out. So that um, we will talk. It's not as if I was not interested in uh, Ada's uh, case. But I want us to take it as a bygone. Because um, I've called um, Obina on phone, okay. and uh, he told me that we are going to see tomorrow, so that this issue will be discussed and be settled once and for all. Papa, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you so much. You're welcome, Adam. Welcome. Thank you. Papa, please forgive me for all my you mistakes. You have been. Forgiven. My husband. <laughs> my husband. Omemunobi. <laughs> Apamo. My sweet pori pori. Hey. Who are you doing? Eh? In a moto anebo. Our people says that charity begins at home. Who are you doing? I'm not seeing all of Mara Ma Poezi. Obina has always been listening to you. This time around will not be an exemption. You got that girl? Hey! You know, I told you, um, Obina is all yes. So I've told him we will talk and he accepted. So uh, it's, it's as good as so. Hmm. Hmm? Papa, you already see, I'm already tired of seeing my father's house. I want to go back to my husband before some woman out there takes him away wow. from me. No, it's not your question. Mm -hmm. Huh? Oh, it's not well. your question. <laughs> <laughs> my husband! I'll come on! Who's that? Baby, it's me, I'm back. Oh, darling, one minute. Hi, darling. Hi. <laughs> I'm back. What's the excitement all about? <laughs> Welcome. I have a surprise for you. Really? Wait. Um, Guess. You know I'm not good at that. Just try. I can't try. Okay. Here. Take a look. What? Charlie and I have been reinstated. We've been called back to work. You're joking, right? No, I'm not. Look at it. Are you serious? <laughs> this is God for Congratulations! Congratulations, darling. Thank you. Oh my god, Thank I'm you. so Thank happy you. for you. Thank you. What? Who's that? My mom. 
I don't want to take a call. No, I think you should take a call. No, I don't want to take a call. Babe. Because this, I do not want anyone to spoil this happy No, moment. come on, it's been a month. It Since doesn't matter. I don't want to pick a call. It's been one month. Honey, please, let's forget about her. Or do you want to pick the call and tell her I'm not No, no, disposed? I'm not going to. No, no, I can't do that. Okay, so. What? I have good news. What's that? Stop, I beg. Let's I go. I celebrate. We do this. Tell me now. What's What? What? <laughs> I'm three months pregnant. Please stop it. I'm not joking. It's the truth. Like seriously? Yeah, seriously. Okay. Jokes apart. Our baby's kicking. <laughs> I don't believe you. But well, that's the truth. <laughs> 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 yes, sugar. Yes. Where are you doing this? You didn't tell me. I'm just telling you. I'm not calling you terrorists. I was even going to call fast. Sorry. It's not an important call. It's okay. So we're able to get in touch with uh, Mary. You said you were going to call her. Right? Who is that? My mother. She's the one calling. All right. When you're done taking the call, okay, you're coming inside. Let me go inside, okay? Okay, let me finish it. Who is that? Charlie, 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 I'm finished. Ken. Yeah. Ah, Charlie, I'm finished. Ken, have I not warned you never, ever come to my compound again? Have I not? Please don't chase me away, please. Help. I need your help. Charlie, I've been sick for the past one month now. I've exhausted all my money buying food and drugs. I can't even feed myself anymore. So I'm talking to you now, I've not even eaten since yesterday. And so, what do you want me to do? I, 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 am I a doctor? No, no, no. I need financial support. Please. Just financial help to buy food and drugs. That's all I want. Ken, I do not have money. I don't have money, Ken. I don't. Charlie. Charlie, we are still friends, though. <laughs> Don't forsake me now, please. I need you now more than ever. It's Ken. Listen, as a matter of fact, my husband does not work in CBN Park. Okay? I mean, honey, why are, you, why are you listening to him? Why? After all he did. Ola, 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 please, I'm very sorry. It was a terrible mistake, and I regret everything. Please forgive me. You should be sorry for yourself. What you did is beyond forgiveness. Despite the fact that we took you as a family friend. Ken, when you're done, you should get up from there and go. Exactly. Honey, let's go inside. Charlie, don't do this. Charlie, it's me, Ken. Charlie, don't do this to me, please. Ken! Charlie, please! Hola! Please show me this. He said he would not waste time. Anyway, I will tell him. Mm -hmm. And greet your husband for me. I will. <laughs> Mama, when are you coming to visit us? My husband has been asking after you. Uh, yeah. It's not as if I don't want to visit you people. But you know this is farming season. If I visit now, who would look after my farm for me? Eh? Don't worry. After this season, our visit. Mama, that shouldn't be a problem. You know Papa can hire laborers. Hmm. No, they can hire laborers. 
Who is that? The door is open. It's me who took her. It's me who took her. Eh? Oh my god. Uh -huh. What did you come to do here? If I I came to see your husband. My husband? No, our husband. Jidia! Mm. No, he's my 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 husband's brother, so he's equally my husband. Mm -hmm. Bam, 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 bam. Okay, he no. is not your husband. Uh, no he problem. is mine, no my problem. own husband. No problem. He's your husband. I came to see him. What for? I need his help. I want him to help me. The same man you asked to mind his business to leave your family alone. So can you take that little child for? Maybe God, I am sorry. <laughs> I am sorry. Please help me. Help you. What is wrong with you? What happened? And why is your face like this? I don't know what is happening to me. I've been very, very down and I've been buying medicine from one patent medicine store to the other. I want to go to the hospital to know what is wrong with me, but I don't have money. Uh, and my children have not been answering my calls. I've been calling them, but they're not picking my calls. Why would they pick your call? Can you say that pick your call? Sorry. Eh? So, what, what do you want my husband to do for you? Is he a doctor? No, he's not a doctor. Uh -huh. I want him to help me call the children. At least they will answer his call. Please, now. Better not be gone. Chilu, Chilu, wait. Wait. Imagine our sweet sister. Our almighty, adorable, sweet sister. Now you want my father's help? Yes. Mother, please now beg your mother, beg your father. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. How have the mighty fallen? <laughs> you know what? My husband is not at home. Eh? Yeah. You have to go. When he comes back, we will tell him that you came. Oh, no problem. I will sit here and wait. Sit here! Mm -mm. Bam, 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 bam. Don't sit! We're not be churchy because the enemies are in the member and they put in a cup of water. Two wrongs are they making for the right because the enemies are in the member. Who be church? So, you know, we're in a church. You know, you're in the member. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Mama, please, I need to go before I get infected by what I don't know. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What's that? What's that? What's uh, allow her to go first. Uh, uh, go. Uh, if my husband comes back, he will come and see you. We will tell him that. I need to talk to your mother now. You're a child of God. You have church mind. Uh, church mind. Mm -hmm. Go. Mm -hmm. Mama, that die, is the door. Oh, I will die. I will die. Mm -hmm. Go now. Go. My daughter wants to go. Go. When our father come, my father come. Tell you to come and see you. Oh? Oh, you to go. Now he will come to you. He's always coming to your house. Adesu, go and bring room for me. Let me sweep her out. Ha! Sweet sister. Sweet sister. You are not even. I'm I'm not even. 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 My hustle band. You needed to have seen her. Hey! The almighty sweet 16 is now bitter 18. If you see her, you would not recognize her at all. So what happened to her? I don't know. If we are, you are near Jizzy. Hey! Hey! 
Mecca, I don't want to see Udoka again. I don't want to set my eyes on her again. Um, mm, mm. Mm. You know that two wrongs cannot make a right. She said her children refuse picking her calls. So it's obvious they don't know about her condition. So how is that my cup of coffee? Um, Nay, if you ask me, I will say you put a call across to one of her daughters. Tell them of their mother's condition and predicament. I am not going to do that. Udoka want me to maintain my space. And that's exactly what I'm doing. If you should do that, how would her children know about her condition? How can they help her? Maybe you put a call to any of them, but for me, I don't think I have such strength. Obutara, Yaburu. If only metala, Oguri si Yaburu. When we were telling her, on a deng, Swiss sixteen, Swiss sixteen, Ubu abuzi bitter eighty. Can get the bitter hundred. Huh. Up to now, none of my daughters have answered my calls. I cannot travel to the city in this condition. Why are my daughters doing this to me? I have tried to send test messages to them. It is not going. I don't know what is wrong with my phone. Anybody home? Sister Odoka. I don't want him to see me in this condition. Where are you, Sister Odoka? The Holy Spirit ministered unto me to come pray for you. That is why I'm here. If you're inside, please come. I need to pray for you. Especially concerning your condition. Hello? Sister Udoka? Hello? Peace be unto this house. My friend Ken is really in need of my help. I know he erred, but I don't want anything to happen to him. I think I should pay him a visit and sort things out with him. Darling, are you alright? I am worried. What? How? I am worried about my friend, Ken. How? Why are you worried? I think... I think he really needs my help. Let me answer my sister. Hello, sis. Okay, I'm coming. I'm coming. Honey, what happened? My sister just called me. Please, let me rush and see her immediately. Okay? It's okay. Honey, well, just be fine. It's All okay. right? All right. Who's keeping Ola now? I don't know. She says she's coming. You mean Uncle's wife called you to inform you that Mama is here? Yeah, she did. <laughs> I was even surprised when I saw her call. I guess Ola is here. Hi, Jeff. Hi, baby Hi. Hi, sis. What is going on? How are you? Fine. Okay. Is everything okay? Everything is not all right, my darling. Uncle's wife called Geraldine to inform her that Mama is ill. So, what's the problem? I don't even know, but... The way she sounded, she said her, her sickness is very critical. 
Stand now I know why she's been calling me. I've been ignoring her call because of what she did to me. I am mad at her. Hmm. She called me too. Same here. So what do we do? Ken? 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 Ken, I'm here. I'm here now, Ken. Ken? Ken? Ken, I'm here. Ken, can you hear me? Ken? 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 I am sorry I have to do this. I could not withstand the news that I have HIV AIDS. That is why I have to end it this way. Please tell Charlie and his family to forgive me. Tell Genika that I love her so much. Goodbye. Ken! 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 Ken, listen to me. I am here now, Ken. I am sorry, Ken. I've listened to you when you came to my house. Get! 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 My God, give me children, please. I beg you. Do not forsake me in this condition as I will die. I know I've heard in many ways. I've made you people angry in every way. I'm disappointed all of you. Please forgive me. I beg your other siblings, please make them to forgive me. Once I get better and get out of this condition, I will turn a new leaf. I will become a better person. I will do. I will be wayward again. I will be wayward again. I will do. I will do so, sweet 16 again. Mama, because you're now HIV positive, you want to give your life to Christ. Okay? Because of it. Mama, we warned you. We warned you, but you wouldn't listen. You told us to leave you alone so you can enjoy your life. You go do wa, kibie wa, nebu sweet sixteen, nebu nka. Now look at what you brought upon yourself, Mama. Are you proud of yourself now? No. You're not even healthy. Who knows what will happen in the next minute? Is this thing not Mama, you disappointed us. I know. I want to want more. Greetings, my beloved sisters. I, I know there is a crescendo of hate spilling in your minds over the unholy affairs I had with my mother. So, okay. so, so it's true you've been sleeping with my mother. So, for how long? I know there is a crescendo of hate spilling in your minds over the unholy affairs I had with your mother. By the grace of God, I want to seize this divine opportunity to ask for your forgiveness. I have wronged you, but remember like the Bible said, 
For all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. I have sinned and I've spoken to God to forgive me. I'm a new man in Christ and by the grace of God, a born again Christian. Please, I know what I've cost you. I know, I know what I've cost you. But I want to beg you as children of God, find it in your heart to forgive me. You see, your mother here came to my office the other time and I asked her to go back and change her ways, but she refused. Yeah. Please, sisters, forgive me. I'm a new man today. How dare you! Shameless man of God! Look at what you did to my mother! How could you stop so now? How could you? You're supposed to lead her to the righteous path, but now! You just to be sleeping with my mother. Look at that condition. Look at my mother's condition. You are here to ask for forgiveness. Is your forgiveness going to restore my mother's health? Is it going to restore her health? How could you stop so now? Pastor. Get out of this compound this minute. It's okay, Gerard. No, 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 sis, don't tell me it's okay. Leave this cup on this minute. It's okay, it's okay. Allow him to talk. It's okay. Sis, I don't want this man in this place. Just take a, take a good look at mama. My head is aching. Leave this place. Pastor, you can go on. Talk. Thank you. Honestly, my heart is full with pains and regrets for my sins. If I tell you I'm a happy man, then you know I lie from the depth of my heart. I'm a memo tell, and I'm subject to temptation. We are just, we are just waylaid by the antics of the devil. I am changed like I told you. You see, God showed me your mother's condition last week. I was here, I came here. But I didn't see her. I was instructed to pray for your mother over her condition. Please, children of God, find it in your heart to forgive me. I'm, I'm a mere mortal. I, I just fell and I'm back again by the grace of God. Please forgive me. I beg you. <laughs> it's all about forgiveness, right? Tell me. Is it going to remedy this situation? Is he going to remedy the situation? By the grace of God, if I pray for her, she'll be fine. Get out of this compound this minute. Leave this compound now. Please calm down. I... Pastor, leave my compound. I know your heart is full. Please calm down. Is it that you live in one piece or you live in pieces? I come in peace. You come in peace? I come in peace. Keep our compound. Children of God, please. To end is human. Leave this compound now, this minute. Please. To err is human and to forgive is divine. And remember the Bible said, for all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. Peace. We are all children. So that is it. As a matter of fact, my wife has been pressurizing me to go see Udoka. But I, I, I can't do that because she practically warned me to stay clear from issues concerning her family. And that's what I'm doing. Eh? Hey, Buka. We are talking about life here. That woman issue is very serious. So how is it my business? It's none of my business. Not Man, there is problem. What is it? Mr. Bode. Eh? It's about your late brother's wife, Udoka. Eh? Is she dead? Um, <laughs> not really. She is not yet dead, but her condition has worsened. So her children took her to the hospital. That's the information I got now. Well, it's okay. Maybe you go there and see her. For me, I don't think I have such interest. Um, but now, don't you think it's time we let go of the past and go and visit her at the hospital? Were you not there when she practically warned me not to come any close to any issues concerning her family? So what, what are you saying? I is, is that not what I'm doing? I know. You are right. But remember, 
to err is human and to forgive is divine. Let go of the past and visit her. You can go to the hospital. Count me out of it. Nine, why? Which one is Unai and why? I'm asking you, which one is Unai and why? Can't you obey simple instructions? She has instructed me to stay clear from her family. And you want me to, 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 to push myself in what that is not my business. It's okay. Uh, 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 please, Neka, we were very busy discussing something deeply before you, you came with your news. I, I just want us to, to, to have a privacy. Two of us together. Nay, no, Dike. Please, mm. talk to your friend. Eh? Beg him. L l let him forgive her. I ain't trying to make her chakwa on. Ichiyebuga, Udoga. She's reaping the fruit of her labor. Oh, 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 now she's here forcing me to go and, 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 and solicit for what I don't know. No. Eh? <laughs> Was she not the one accusing you? She accused Ibe. And just of late, she accused me too. Nobody is clear before her. <laughs> that is what suits her best. Let her suffer and carry her cross. We warn her severally about her attitude. Did, did she listen? The answer is no. no. She did not listen. Well, um, um, she forget about it. Right, so, what I was saying is, it's still Ghana is going to be. Hola. Hmm? Are you okay? Where is Geraldine? Oh, she just stepped out to get something. Are you okay? I want her to tell you guys something, but since she's not around, I'll wait till she comes back. Well, you, you can actually tell me. Maybe when she comes back, you'll tell her too. How's that? Hola, <sighs> Mama is reactive. Mama is reactive? Reactive to what? How? Mama is HIV positive. Really, but my husband called me this afternoon that Ken tried to commit suicide. Ken, why? Because he discovered that he had AIDS and wanted to drink poison. Hi, this is unbearable. Goodness. Maybe Mama must have contacted it from him. So, sis, have you told Mama? I haven't. The doctor advised to allow her to recover fully before letting her know. She's responding to treatment.
Look what you've done to yourself. Pedro, Charlie, what's the problem? I was so worried when you called me. I had to leave everything. I was going to come and see you, Charlie. That's my name, Charlie. Pedro, that is my name. What is the problem? I am finished. I am in trouble. What kind of trouble are you talking about? I should have resisted the devil when she came to me. Hey! You're still not making sense. What devil are you talking about? The devil is around us. The devil lives here. I'm confused. That woman is a devil. Charlie? That woman. Ekwesu inafuana. The woman is a devil! Pedro, calm down. What woman are you talking about and who is the devil here? Our mother-in-law. My wife's mother. Okay. I am listening. My wife called me. Okay. And told me that mama tested positive to HIV. Oh my goodness. Bad news. But how is that your concern? Why are you worried about that? Charlie, it was just once. So. It was just once. Just once. I did it only once. Really? But she pushed me! Because I'm still confused. Charlie? I was on my own. Okay. I was on my own. The devil came. Mama sweet sister. Ah, I just so she could live young, young, young. Ah, boy. Mama sweet sister. Ah, I just so she could live young, young, young. Ah. Mama ni because you want me gay. Ah, I just want to show you what they feel, feel, feel. Ah, Jay, I'm pushing woman to a minister. Ah, I just want everything a double wall. Ah, women boy, I watch your husband there. Ah, I'm so insistent, I'm not giving up. So you stay here alone, you know? Yes, ma'am. She's out. 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 She's uh-huh. I think this is me. Um, no, I have to worry about it. If you know you, then you could prepare you something sumptuous. Very nice. And I'll be fast about it, okay? I'm coming now. <laughs> hey! Wow! Where's this old man coming from? Is that all? Charlie, you know your mother-in-law. You know her very well. Before I knew it, she had prepared a delicious meal. Okay. That's all you go to be on, be on, be on. Jay, now quench can woman know I'm in this year. This man wants to kill me with food in this house. Everything I double while I Women know ya, watch your husband there. Yeah. Pedro! Don't tell me that... that you had a carnal knowledge of our mother-in-law. It's not like that. I just said she prepared a delicious meal for me. Eh? It was just once and she pushed me. Pedro. She pushed me into do she lured me. She seduced me. Oh, come on! Pedro. She's a who? How could you how, how did you do it? How could you? It's not me, it's not me, or It's the devil. It's how can I do that? It's the devil inside her that entered me. 
Now I know why you're sad. I cannot know why you are worried. Of course, you, you. To thinking you've contacted the virus, right? Wait, Charlie. Is it showing? Is it showing on my in my eyes? I, I don't want to die. Yeah. Ah, hold on, Pedro. Uh -huh. You're not going to die. Uh -huh. First thing first, okay? You have to go to the hospital, get tested, so you have to know your status. Okay? Get tested again. When I'm, there's no point for that now, Charlie. I already have the virus. Oh, you just tell me if it's showing or not. Pedro, do not conclude yet. Go to the hospital, get tested. You have to do this as soon as possible before your wife comes back. Hi, Chineke. That's the point. What do I tell my wife? But there's no point. Eh? There's no point going to the doctor. I already have the virus. I just don't know how to die. I... No, Pedro, don't conclude. Go to the hospital first. Okay? Let us be on the right track. Yeah. Yeah. No, 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 Charlie. There's no need to. I'll just go there so that people will be seeing me. No, no. Hi. Why are you concluding on your own? Is it showing? Nothing is showing. Glory, glory, glory to the Father. Oh, glory, glory, glory to the Father. Hosanna, Hosanna, Hosanna. Blessed be the name of the Lord, my God. Hosanna, Hosanna, Hosanna. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Father, Lord. Father, King of Glory, I thank you. I thank you for everything you've been doing in my life. Father, I thank you for what you have done for me. Eh? Father, Lord, I am a sinner. A chronic sinner. But you still found me worthy. Father, Lord, look at what you have done for me today. I say thank you for everything. Father, King of Glory, I don't know you loved me this much. Eh? Look at how you have put my enemies to shame. Eh, Father Lord, I promise you, eh, from this moment, I'll give my life to Christ. Eh? Father, I will not do anything bad again. Eh? Father, I promise not to go back to my sins again. For saving me like this. For putting my enemies to shame. Father Lord, I'll surprise you. Charlie, yeah. I'm confused. Confused about what? I have a question. Okay. Why am I not positive? I thought when you sleep with someone who is HIV positive, you're supposed to be positive. Yes, you are right. But maybe, just maybe, maybe you had sex with her first before Ken. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. Wait. So, Ken is the carrier of the disease? Maybe. I think so. And I allow him into this house. He eats with us. You, know, you can't contact from eating from the same plate with a carrier. It is possible his hands touched mine. It doesn't matter. He can't still contact it through that means. Charlie, mm -hmm. you need to go for tests. Why? You need to go and test yourself. Me? Yes. And I'm negative. How are you negative? You told me that our mother-in-law is sweet. <laughs> said I said her food. No, 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 no. No, no, no. You said you said that you have tested her and she's sweet. Her food. You told me that she's sweet. Her food is No, sweet. you said she's sweet. I said her food. Charlie, I didn't say she. Go for test. Oh. <laughs> Ma. My beautiful daughter. Forgive me. You're my in love with you, my first son. Because you're married to my first daughter. Please forgive me. Forgive me. Chaliogo. Please forgive me. Geraldine, the baby of the house. Thank you. 
this was in me. It's okay, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay, it's okay. Hey, Buka. My husband, I am sorry for everything. You've been forgiven. That's why I'm here. It's okay. It's okay. My co-wife, please look up on me with mercy. When you get home, tell her, they said that I am sorry. I spoke to Geraldine's husband on the phone and I've asked him to forgive me as well as he has forgiven me. Thank you for all your assistance. All this well I've been seeing. God bless all of you for being a good family to me, irrespective of my flaws and shortcomings. Please forgive me. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. We've forgiven you. Odikato. Odikato na wan. It's okay. Oh. Mama, it's okay. We've all forgiven you. That's why we're here. And I was going to say that uh, having HIV is not the end of the world. It's never a death sentence. The fact that uh, you have the virus doesn't mean you're going to die. As long as you continue to take your re retroviral drugs, it, it helps you stay healthy. So don't worry, you'll be fine. Thank okay? you so much. <laughs> Thank you, my son. Thank you. We love you. And today is Mama's happy birthday. Happy Hi. birthday to you. Happy, happy birthday, birthday to you. Oh happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Yo, 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 ah, oh, mama sweet. 